Yo, what's up? Me and my main man, Kevin. We're friends up in New York. Friends up in New York. We both had the common sense to get the heck out of that place. So, we're in Balboa Park, out here in San Diego, California. And there's usually a Muslim booth set up. We're gonna go uh, find it if they're here. And hopefully Sheikh Uthman Ibn Farouk is here. Got some questions about his track here. Now the problem is, Sheikh Uthman likes to go off on like 300 different tangents, but hopefully we can get through the track, even if it takes a while. We haven't gotten through any actual arguments. You guys in the gotcha. house still? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, right here. So we got the we got the uh, we got the track right here. Sure, sure. Um, basically, just so you know, this is kind of what I'm interested in. Not the scientific issue in particular, but okay. when positions give an argument for why they're true. Because there aren't there aren't a lot of actual religions. There aren't a lot of religions that say here's how you can know if this is true. Right? Christianity says, you know, Old Testament prophecies and resurrection. Um, Islam has a bunch of arguments. Mormonism says a couple of things like, you know, you feel the burning within your heart or something like that if you if you pray sincerely to know that it's true. Atheism will offer a couple of arguments like the problem of evil and stuff like that. You but really think that's, that, a, that's a strong argument? No, I didn't say, it was, uh, I didn't say any of this is so, a strong so let me argument. Just, I mean, I'd like to ask you because you're, you're, you're well bred on all of this stuff. So my neighbors are Mormon. We already talked to them many a times, right? Kind of so do you believe that Mormons are Christian, first off? Um, no, but I don't, I don't study it, so I don't really, I don't really gotcha. comment on anything. That's it. That what about Jehovah's Witnesses? I would say no. But I don't, I don't, those are considered cults, I don't really do the purpose of life. Uh, really so they're off cults. the manhood. They're off the methodology, right? I would say, yeah, because they, 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 they reject some, some fundamental doctrines. Basically, gotcha. you, can, you, can, you can adhere to, similar in Islam, you can adhere to certain core okay. doctrines. You can disagree on lots of stuff, but not on, not on, the, uh, not on the essentials. All right, so I have a quick question for you. I know, I know, I know, relax, bro. But, this is, but last time you came, um, you had brought up Nikatir and stuff, and I, I actually went home and looked up. You, you had just mentioned a part. Actually, I wasn't even making his opinion. We'll get into that we some other time because you don't have your book. That's enough. no problem. That's no problem. Super simple. Okay. Super you guys want me to tell you? I got I'm important. I'm important. You are much more familiar with than I. How can you right? live a comfortable life? You're, 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 no. you're not familiar with it? I've heard of it. I don't, I don't, yeah, and I have a copy of the MacArthur study. You have, but it's not. Yeah, it's not. Not the so book I'm I go to. Trying to. Wait, are you actually? I'm sitting here listening. I know, I know, brother. Look. You asked your question last time. I answered. I had a question waiting for you. Yeah, but last time when I when I came when I came up to you last time, I said I have a question about this. Then I wanted to get a one out of the way quick. Oh yeah, so and then it took us forever. But, but last time you brought a different pamphlet. No, I said right? when when, we, when I came, I said I have a question about this one. Okay. And then I said, but here's a quick quick question. But right, I asked a quick question about that, and then we spent the entire time on that. So you brought up a different question, right? You brought it up. I didn't bring up that pamphlet last time, right? Yeah, this is, I mean, this is well, a doubt. I have a question related to that one. So we got to finish one before we jump, because you you, you want to jump away so from we're, it. So we're, 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 yeah, but this is why I came. Right? This, I, I this is a Dawa booth, right? Well, this you're is producing, you're handing out tracks. Yes. You're handing out tracks. Yes. I had some questions, just, I'm not even, I'm not even, I don't even really want to criticize terribly. I just want to clarify what the Quran is saying about sure. these scientific issues no because problem. some of the times it doesn't sound like that's what the Quran is saying to me gotcha. but you know the Arabic and so you can break it down no problem so so can we like just it, can we like hold it, off on that till, till uh, after let me let me say so David 
you came out last time and you, you brought up a question from a pamphlet, right? And when you open up a question, then when I have a question for you, I would appreciate if we have a conversation, right? You can't be like, okay, I'm gonna bring up this stuff, but if you have a question, we're not gonna address it until I'm done with all of mine. So this is related to the same one you brought up about scholars and their explanation. And you said, especially because you know our timing, and when I had to go, you were having your personal conversation with your camera talking about, you know, a, a, a Christian can just pick up a, a study and, and, you know, accept what's in there and so on. But a Muslim, he's trying to throw scholars under the bus. And you know, and you guys should know, I wasn't throwing Ibn Kathir under the bus. I love Ibn Kathir. You didn't actually like understand what Ibn Kathir because I was telling you, it was already time for me. I have, this is not my, so this is why we got to clarify this, right? Because this is not my job. This is your job, it's not my job. I don't get paid, I don't have a Patreon, I don't have supporters that pay me. You got those there Hamas bucks coming in though, right? There what? You got those Hamas bucks coming in, right? I have right? no money coming from Hamas. No Hamas, Hamas bucks. Okay. No Hamas bucks. Okay. I, I, I don't even agree with Hamas's methodology, just to be clear, right? But you do have a Patreon account that pays your bills, right? By the way, I said as we were walking over here, I said, hey, we're going to have some questions about this. We can do the Dawah, but... I think he's going to sidetrack onto a bunch of other issues not, before we ever get here. I'm not. I'm going to make sure that this is a conversation, not a trial, right? So if you have questions, great. But since you've already been here and I've answered question, when I have a question, yep, we're going to get to it literally, too, the right? first time, literally the first time I stepped up, sure. I walked out, I grabbed this track, yeah. and I said, you weren't even here that day. Because I oh, came okay. on a Saturday, you come on got Sunday. Sure. You're on a Saturday, and I said, hey, if i got a couple questions about these, can I come back? They said, yeah, 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 yeah. Right. So then I came back last time I had questions about this, we ended up talking about the other one because I thought it would take like five minutes and it took sure. like two hours. Sure. So let me let me just respond to that now. You came my oh, this is your third time now, right? Or fourth time? If you take the Saturday, it's your fourth time, right? Third time. No, no, no it's the Saturday, yeah, yeah. We just grabbed some tracks. So that I, I know the three one yeah. counting thing throws you off sometimes, but let's just stick with this, all right? So let's see, you, you came on a Saturday, I wasn't here, you took stuff. You came back the next Sunday. You didn't bring this up. You brought up other stuff, and I answered you. When I walked up to you, I said, "I said I got a question about this. I was about to make on a video Saturday? on it." On the Sunday that you came the first time? No, you didn't. You and Anthony walked. No, up. that was Anthony. Anthony was talking. You weren't with Anthony. I wasn't no. arguing. Okay. No. But you, and you, matter of fact, we went with your topic that time. You wanted to talk about that. Right. Stuff. Right. But you guys came. You opened up a subject. We had a conversation. You came back again. You brought up a, a, a track and a question, and I took it. And I will take this today, no problem. But what you're doing is, when I have a question for you, you're trying to hide from it. So I'm saying, hey, we'll have this, no, we'll no, have this no, balanced no, no. Actually, conversation. Actually, this is very different. This is very different. Gotcha. This is, you're handing out material. Sure. Saying, this is how we know Islam is true. Sure. You're, you're the one who told me. Yeah. If I have uh, questions or concerns or something doesn't make sense, ask sure. a scholar. Yep. So I'm sitting here taking the materials you're handing out. Great. Asking a scholar, sure. which is what you told me to do, and as soon as I come ready to ask a scholar, right. I have a question for you right. yep. on something the, the that reason, we weren't talking about. The reason is because you're not listening to what Stephen the question is, afraid of it maybe, but this is no, 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 okay. concerned about not getting so to this. I have concerned told about you, the sidetrack. I have told you we will get to this today, inshallah. Okay. Okay. Well, why can't, if we're getting to this, why can't we do this, why can't this we do this first? And do that? The earlier conversation. You're not even listening to what the question is, and I don't want to jump from one conversation to the next without finishing a conversation. Okay, can we right? set a can we set a time limit on this? Sure. Like do it rapid fire. Let's do half an hour. No, half an hour. Ten minutes. Ten minutes. Ten minutes. Ten minutes. So last time you said that a different Christian, issue. Okay. Sorry. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. So last time you said that a Christian could just pick up a study book and then he could take it and wouldn't have to go to a living scholar ask for any other explanations. So I actually have a MacArthur study Bible and I was looking about slavery and I was looking at the issue of copyist errors. And the MacArthur Bible tells us that there are copyist errors in the Bible, right? The MacArthur Bible tells us that at a time God allowed slaves to be beaten. So would you agree that that's correct? That you think God allowed that you can beat a slave and as long as they live a day, it's okay, that's their property? Uh, that passage isn't, if you're talking about the verse you brought up last time, right. that verse isn't actually about what you think it is. It's not about slave beating? That verse is about punishing for capital, that verse is about judging intent for capital punishment. Interesting, right? Is it? Yes. So let's bring it up. This is to do with capital punishment or disciplining your slave? No, this is Leviticus. It is not Leviticus. David Wood. <laughs> it's Exodus. Okay. Okay. 
hit you with me? You, no, see, no, this no, is no. why you didn't want me to ask the question. Well, right? no, 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 this me. is why. This is why. Exodus 21, 2021. Read the verse for us, Mr. Wood. 2021. Not Notwithstanding, if he remains alive a day or two, he shall not be punished for he is his property. Keep going. If men fight and hurt twenty and twenty one, you didn't read. And if a man beats his male or female servant with a rod so that he dies under his hand, he shall surely be punished. Notwithstand, if he remains alive a day or two, he shall not be punished for he is his property. So you, David, would believe that God, Jesus, allowed that if a person beats their slave. And as long as he, his, his beating is severe enough that he dies a day later, you cannot punish the man because a human being is another human's property that he can kill just letting him live a day. A uh, couple issues. A couple issues. Oh, uh -huh. One, the position of Christians, according to the New Testament, is that God is that God did allow things in the past that he didn't approve of, they didn't think are good, <laughs> but because of the hardness of our hearts, he allowed us to do them. Right? Wow, this is amazing. Can you? It's not. It's it's basic Christianity. When Jesus when Jesus is asked about divorce, can you divorce your wife for any or any reason? He said, and they asked, well, in the law of Moses, you're allowed to give your wife a a, a, a notice of divorce, and and you can you can just divorce her. And Jesus said, God allowed you to do that because of the hardness of your hearts. But that's not what he wants. He doesn't want he doesn't want that situation. So that's one. As far as this. This is a series of commands that are talking about capital punishment, which we offer, which we also have now, right? We have capital punishment. What do you, do you guys have that in California still? No, I don't think so. No, Maybe okay. do. Certain certain states have capital punishment. Texas does, right? Certain states have capital punishment. Meaning, uh, if you commit capital murder, that's a death penalty. But there are lo there are lesser versions. There's second degree murder. There's manslaughter and things like that. What this is talking about, a man kills his slave, a man beats his slave, right? Male or female? They're talking about the presumption of intent. Intent, right? What's the intent here? The, that's what they're talking about, right? They're going to presume, for, for this case of capital punishment, whether you sentence a man to death for murder, if you beat your slave and you just beat him to death, yeah, like you this. just beat him to death. He wasn't beaten to death. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. yeah, it's worse than this. So they would, they would not. That would not be capital punishment. They would right. say so. So beating worse than this because it beat him to death. If you the next beat day. him to death, right. if you beat him to death, <laughs> right. they're going to presume that your intent was to murder him. Where is that in the Bible? Yeah, I mean, it's right there. This is where. I don't see that anywhere there. You, you're, you're making this up, David. You're making this remember up. This, you, you because, this? Remember you this. Remember this. Remember this. Because about we're about Quran. we're about to read no, the Quran, no, 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 and no, now no, I get no, to ask, no, no, where does Allah no, no. say that? Right. Not yes, your interpretation. Sure. Where does He say that? Sure. Listen. When we go to the Quran, we go to the scholars of Islam. We go to Hadith. We go to all of that, no problem. But when last time when I was telling you the scholarly opinion is not a, a, a fact in itself, you have to look at the evidences. Mm -hmm. You told me I'm throwing scholars under the bus. Mm -hmm. Today you're making up verses from the Bible with no concept and no. evidence. No, now okay. I'm tell, now I'm telling you, but so actual where is scholars the, who understand who, where, where who is interpret the, evidence, the Jewish law. Where What's is that? the evidence? Of I don't. This saying. is not my position. I am not. This, this is not the Bible. Not <laughs> you your guys, position. you guys understand. Bible, look, look at, position. look at Laffy. <laughs> look at La look at Laffy here. Right? Hey, don't make fun of people. Okay? No, 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 no. Laugh, the cracking of laughing. Right? Yeah. You're handing out materials. Yeah. Right? Again, I you, you see, you see, he no, can't no, no, answer no, no. it. He I can't back. answer the Bible, I'm, so he wants to swim. I'm trying to David answer. Wood. I'm trying to answer. Okay, I'm listening. There are a series of commands. Okay. I'll just give you. I'll just. I'll just. No, talk about this one. This particular. I'm trying to. I'm trying to. I'm trying to. Okay. So, if you beat if you beat your slave to death, yes. All right. They're going to presume that that's murder, capital okay. punishment. Okay. If you beat him and he gets up and walks around and the, dies the, later, the, the presumption the presumption would be wow. that you weren't trying to kill him. Okay. Right? No, 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 no. Okay. I'm listening. And when it says when it says property there, it actually says your silver. So what that passage is saying is, is your slaves are valuable. It is your property. Yeah, in this translation, in, okay. in the actual Hebrew, it says you're silver. So that's what that means. What that means is, if you paid money for a slave, you bought your slave. Your slave is part of your wealth. Wow. I don't know why you're saying wow. When that's Muhammad, that's had, shocking Muhammad, Muhammad had all kinds he, of slaves. He, did, did he buy Black slaves? Slave? Did he buy slaves? Did he buy or, slaves? Or were they through war? Were, were they prisoners of war? So it's okay to have slaves through war. So listen, 
when you take a person out of war, it, Muslims aren't allowed to buy. Can I, can no, I they weren't allowed to buy slaves. Can I, can I finish? So if we look and we see Muhammad's companions buying slaves, you're in trouble. Can I finish? Sure, sure, sure. Go ahead. It's this thing, like, like you know. Okay. So in Islam, you cannot take a free man and enslave him. Do you understand? There's a hadith, since you like to learn about hadith, where Allah says, Hadith Qudsi, that the one who enslaves a free man, I will be his plaintiff on the day of judgment. We don't have the right to enslave people. Hadith. Right, Dave? You paying attention? Are you? All right. So, Muhammad so, had right? slaves. Can he I, had on Jasha. Can I, can he I had... finish? Yeah, okay. Thank you. Right? Now, if somebody's captured through war, meaning they are a war captain, like for example, if you go to war with another country and you find people fighting you and you take them, now, these are not considered slaves in the sense that you went to Africa and just picked up regular people and made them enslaved, right? These are people that were trying to kill you and you're taken into a, a captured state out of war. In Islam, in Islam, you cannot have slavery in the sense of the Western world where you just take a free person, you go to Africa or you go to the continent and you just kidnap them, okay? Neither did the Prophet was a Sahab. Wait, so, so when they attack Kaibar, when right they here? attack Kaibar, right. they slaughter a bunch of people, they sure. take a bunch of slaves. Sure. Kaibar was a but war? they attack them. No. <laughs> yeah, they were. It's like they're, it's like they're walking out to the, it's like they're walking out to the fields. They're walking out to the fields and Muhammad and his what, companions what, what, what happened down upon in them. What was the context? The context was the Jews are sitting there minding their own business. <laughs> they're going out to the field. They're going out to the field. So, and so, Muhammad and his so, army swept so, down. So, so that is not right? They weren't marching that is up to not the field. Right. No, you, you, you don't know the context at all. You, I, I'm shocked that David Wood is so ignorant of what happened. I'm, I'm really sorry. That's what I read. That's but what I, I read. But, but you read the wrong things. You go online, you just read Islamophobe website. You don't read books. That's the problem. I don't. Listen, I have a whole series on this. If you have the time, watch it so you can know. In Kaiba, there was a contract. Did you know this? No, you didn't know this. He didn't know this. <laughs> What's the source? What's the source? Ibn Kathir, Bidaya wa Nihaya, At-Tabari, Ibn Sa'ad, any book. Ibn Maghazi, Ibn Ishaq, pick up any book. Okay, what's the contract? Right? There was a contract with the Jews of Medina, and this is when Rasulullah went to Medina. Everybody, kids know this. Right? When you go there, that they, if somebody from the outside were attacked, you would not support them. We would defend Medina together. Okay? Banu Qunayza. You know Banu Qunayza? That's, that's, that's what the Jews of Medina. Yes. Was that, a, was, was, that a, was that a was that a treaty with Kaibar? <laughs> you didn't know Kaibar in the context of Medina. <laughs> no, 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 no. Kaibar, no, Kaibar is a different area. You think Kaibar is Medina? Kaibar, Kaibar is in Medina. Precincts, precincts of Medina. Did the you Jews of Kaibar? Kaibar did the, so there's no. Have you they're, been to Kaibar? They're under the same. Have you been there? No. I have. Okay. <laughs> Look, they, they visit. They visit the site yes, of, of the course. massacre at Kaibar. Listen, but, I didn't visit the site of the massacre of Kaibar. I visited Medina and went on a historic trip. I looked at Badr. I looked at Uhud. I looked at Kaibar. I looked at all these places to know the history, so I don't make a fool out of myself so the Jews of by Kaibar. saying that Kaibar was not under the treaty of Medina. The Jews no. of Kaibar agreed to the treaty of Medina. Yes. Okay. What you, you, you know, I just gave you four yeah, 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 sources. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, you mentioned it, but where? Bidai Wanihaya. Look it up. You know Bidai when you You don't know Bidai when you got I got See, but this is the problem. You act like you know about it now. But you know. No, no, no. I got Sahih. I got Tabari. I got Ibn Asad. Tell me where in there, and if it's not there, what the world is. Sahih Sibta, a book of history. And, and by the way, there's no such thing as Sahih Sitta, it's put over Sitta. Because not all of them are Sahih, only two of them are. Anyways. You know it's called Sahih Sitta. It shouldn't be, that's a mistake. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. That's fine. Uh, that wasn't even for you, oh, you're not at that level. Yet? Huh? We over 10 minutes yet? Oh, we are over 10 minutes, but you have an answer. So the question that I want to know, because you try to jump to Khaybar, and just to clarify your additional point, Khaybar, Banu Kanuza, Banu Nadir, Banu Kuneza, all of them, Kanuka, and all of them had treaties not to help the, the outside invading forces. Because the people of Khaybar and Banu Kanuka and others betrayed the treaty and sent weapons and fighters to fight against the Muslims, this is why there was an attack on Khaybar. And since you didn't know that, Kaibar violated the treaty. Yes. And Muslims and, and, did nothing and, to violate the treaty. No. Look it up. I, I'm surprised you don't know this already. Listen, I'll tell you what. Whoa, man, I just gave it to you like three times. You want to write it down for us? Yeah, I know you say remember this. I know you say that, but like where? This is why. What do you mean? Like, I don't know the page number yeah, offhand, but you get it. Okay, I'll tell you what. Right? Give that to listen, you, right? listen, listen, listen. I'll do you one better. If you give me your number, and I won't give it to anybody, just like I have it with Sam. I'll send you a link, or if you want to look it up yourself, on Majdribad's site, 
we have a we have a whole video that gives you each book, each reference, each page on what happened, and you can educate yourself, mm -hmm. and then you won't look like a fool. So just to, just just to be clear, <laughs> yeah. your position is yes, Muhammad and his companions had slaves, yes. but they didn't just run around taking free right. people; they fought them, then took them. They took them as captives of war. Yes, they took them as captives of war, then they had slaves. Yes, and then so, and so then, Anjasha then, was taken as a war captive. Hold on, hold on. And then there are rules and regulations. One of them, you cannot beat your slave like this. You cannot kill your slave. If you kill your slave in Islam, even if he's a war captain, you can't beat listen, your slave. Listen, listen, let me oh. speak, bro. Here. <laughs> if you if you kill your war captain, you will be held accountable. You can't just kill them without. This is not your property. This is not. You can't just kill anybody you want. I am in shock, to be honest with you. You can't, you can't kill your slave in, in the Bible either. Okay, so that's here, a death, that's a death so, so, so this is the question, right? If you, if this person comes and I beat him such a beating that he goes to the ER, he lives a day and then from my beating he dies. Did I kill him or not? It's over, bro. It's over. Like I'm on hijab today. You're, 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 you're still. You're, you know it's over. No, you're still. You know not, you're, it's you're over. Still right? not this is talking. Now answer my question. If this, guy, if, if, if this guy gets beat, this guy simple, gets beat, right? I beat him. Uh -huh. He lives a day if in the ER. If you go to trial, if you go to yes, trial yes. in the United States of America, yes. Right? If you and you beat this man, yeah, and, and then he was walking around for a couple days, no, 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 and then he died. He goes to the ER. That is manslaughter. Where does it say yeah, walking? Let's suppose he goes to the ER. You, you're lying, bro. Come on. Listen, look, look. It does not say walking. He just lives a day or two. Okay, it he lives a day or two. You're making okay, verses he goes up. to the ER. He goes, he goes to the, to the ER. ER, and he dies from my beating. Dies from your beating. That is murder in America. No. Oh, you don't know the No, law. they're going to judge your intent. Okay. If, if we're out there fighting, okay. you and me are fighting, and I just, no, I just, no, no. I this just, is not I a fight. This is you. not a fight. It's your slave. You take a rod, male or female, yeah. and you beat they them, and they intent. live a day. So if I'm they beating this man, if I'm beating this man, and from my beating, he goes to the ER, and he just lives a day, then you're going to say that that's not, I didn't murder they him? They're going to look at your intent. <laughs> you don't think they're gonna, look, do not look, understand. Listen, do you not, do listen, know that there is a crime listen, called manslaughter? That's where you listen, kill someone, you know but you weren't intending to murder him. Manslaughter is not when you take a rod and you beat somebody so yes, bad that I'm, they die. See, you're, 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 oh my goodness. You're making this oh my goodness. up now. You don't know the law. You know. You don't know the law. Okay, okay, let me ask David Woods. Let if, me ask you simple. If, if, simple if I question. hit you with a bat, right. but I'm just you, trying to hit you with a bat, I'm just trying to beat you, and you die, that's not murder. That's manslaughter. Listen, when you took that hammer and beat your dad, if he had died a day later, would they have charged you for murder or not? They would have judged my intent. You took a hammer Do you to your father's that intent head. Plays a, oh, no, of no, course no. it does, but yeah. listen. Yeah. Look, you're just trying to avoid it and you know you're caught. Like, this is a sad no, thing. No, no, I listen. Do. No, I don't. You, when you took your dad and you beat him with a hammer, this right? Is, any is that what happened? Law. Any any court of law. Answer, answer my question. Mm -hmm. This is that what happened, right? Yeah. If your dad had died, and I'm glad he didn't, and I'm sure you do, you are too, right? Let's say you took him to the ER, they put him on life support, but a day later he died. You took a rod, like in the Bible, and you beat this man. It wasn't a rod. Right? A hammer. Okay. Right? So, would they not put you in trial for murder? They could. They could. Now, now they could. No more manslaughter now. Can, can, can we listen? Can we go, go, ahead. go ahead. Can I answer that? Go ahead. Go ahead. Okay. They would look at the intent. If they're judging on intent, they say, wait, hammer to the head uh -huh. looks like the intent was to kill him, right? <laughs> exactly. If I'm hitting you with a rod because you disobeyed me, you know, yeah, yeah. a rod. A beating so bad rod, that you die a day yeah. later from it. Yeah. yeah. What they're saying is that's something different from capital murder. Because, and this is where, when it says he is your silver, they're talking about presumption. They don't want to sentence someone to death who didn't, wasn't actually guilty of something worthy of death, right? So, so beating, trying to beat your slave and he dies. So, beating they your don't slave. know what your intent is. Okay, okay, yes, we agree that beating your slave is bad. We're saying, what are Bible. you intending to kill? <laughs> listen. Wait, 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 listen, listen. Let, no, see, see, now you want to jump because you know you're God, right? No, listen, I know you're being Listen, 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 listen. Let me ask your camera. Right, let me ask you a question, right? Let's no, ask no, a simple no, no, question. No, 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 you know, why not? Okay, Mark, let me ask you, because unless you want to be in the conversation, Mr. Cameraman, it's a free country. You want me to ask you, sir? No, no, actually, okay. Huh? What? It doesn't pick up. In fact, oh, if you yeah. want to answer, you should come over here. This is shotgun no, no, mic I'm that records your here. I'm asking your cameraman, as an African-American man, I just want to ask you this question. When David Wood is saying that if a person has a slave, that's his property, 
and if he beats him so bad with a rod, male or female, that he lives one day, he should not be judged because that's his property. It's not, you, it's not that he won't be judged. It's oh, that wow. he won't be judged for capital punishment. Where does it say that? You're making that up. Where does I'm it not say that? making that up. Okay, let's read the verse again, verbatim. Okay. So this is why you you you're ashamed of the Bible. And if a man, and you're listening, sir, because you're recording this, I want you to know what you're promoting. And if a man beats his male or female servant with a rod, so that he dies under his hand, he shall surely be punished. He should be punished. Didn't say murder, just punished. Notwithstanding, notwithstanding, if he remains alive, not walking around, he made that up. If he remains alive a day or two, just remains alive, he shall not be punished. No punishment. He shall not be punished. <laughs> this, this is Bible that he wants to dodge. Don't worry, we will get to that. But there this, this is talking reality. About, okay? That's Hold talking on, about let me capital finish. punishment. I'm, I'm These reading. are capital crimes. It says punishment. It does yeah, not say for capital death. punishment. It does not say capital. You're making that up. Now, it says, he shall not be punished, for he is his property. Do you, sir, as an African American man recording this thing, that if a man is taken as a slave by force and beaten by his master, a woman or a man, such a beating that he dies a day later, that master has no punishment because that's his property? You want to promote that? You want this? Do you want to, to promote? Do you want to promote the old covenant which we're not under? Do you? Is no. that what you believe, want to do? He no. believes it's from you. God, no. from Jesus. Muhammad believes from God. God. Muhammad Muhammad did not God. believe in this. So this, didn't? Is, this, this. No. He didn't this, in no. He did not. Why, why is it that in listen, Surah 5, listen, verse 43, listen, the yeah. Jews come to Muhammad? This, this is why you're in trouble now. Now, yeah. my, my view, my view, which I got from scholars, is that in context, this is talking about Which capital scholars? punishment. Which scholars? See, now, now you can't name a scholar. Which scholar? Name him. Name him. Name him. I will lie let, caught on no, camera. No, no. Name him. Woo! Name him. Name him, Dave. We're trying Name to keep him. this friendly. Name a scholar. I am friendly. I have to look it up. Name this a scholar. <laughs> he got it from a scholar, but doesn't remember the name of a scholar. Name the scholar, Dave. Same thing, Dave. Then I Name respond. the scholar. Look, You're making it up on the fly. If you. If you name forget the name of the guy, I can look it up right after okay. we're done. Okay. I can look it up Send right it. after we're done. Now, now, what I'm going to ask you also yeah. is content. Hang on, hang on. I didn't finish what I was saying. So, what I heard, because this isn't my area. The Bible, not your area? <laughs> Old Testament. But this law, is the part of the Bible Jewish you give context. out. No, no, you're talking about to giving out. Don't you give this out? out? You don't give Bibles out? out? You don't tell people to read the Bible? You see this? What do we come here for? Hey, this is the Dawah yeah. Dodge. No, no, we will hey, get I to have this. some questions don't about worry. your material. We're we never going to get to this. We will. We're never going to get to this. But you and he see, won't even let me give the answer. can't answer the Bible. So here's the position. This is not his expertise. Can I answer? Amen. You answer the camera because you can't answer me. Amen. I'm a philosopher. Amen. That, that is my, that is my job. You're a philosopher. Uh, yes. Of what? That's what I'm trained. Of what? Greek philosophy? Philosophy. Or the Bible? <laughs> It's you, actually, you, you, you're not, you're not no, expert no, of the Bible. I'm not, I'm not a scholar of the Bible. No. Okay. You, you didn't know this? I didn't know My this. academic I, background okay. is philosophy. But you're a, a Christian apologist, right? I have a right? PhD in philosophy. You're Dr. Right? Wood. I don't even know that. I don't. I'm not a master of Old Testament right. texts, right? All so right. I see someone in a lecture. They talk about it. I can raise the point. Other than that, if you ask me a question, my inclination would be to go study it. Gotcha. Which, so, is why, which is why, so why, don't you which is why I'm asking you something about okay. the stuff you're Let's handing out. This. I know Let's you're handing this stuff out. Let's do this. Let's just let me give Let's the, the answer, and I'll give you the source afterwards. So, the context of that passage, talking about situations where judges will have to judge intent in cases for capital murder, capital punishment. And so, there's a question of intent, we do the same thing in the United States. And so, when it talks about punishment there, it's talking about capital punishment, sentencing someone to death, and what it's saying is, if he survives, then the presumption will be that you didn't intend to kill him. Even if you beat, even this is a brutal beating, but we have that in the United States. If you beat someone brutally, and he survives, or even if he dies right there, we even, we even have it if you beat someone to death, it's a question of intent. Right? Were you intending to kill him or were you intending to beat this guy up? Those are two different things. The position of the Bible is, if you're going to sentence someone to death, then you make sure his intent was to do whatever you're sentencing him to death for. That's all, that's all I'm saying. Now, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Now, now, now watch him throw scholars under the bus. It's almost 4 o'clock here. 
Almost four o'clock. How long have we been bikes. here? Thirty okay. minutes. I had, Look, I had questions MacArthur, about this. MacArthur, MacArthur Study Bible. He's talking about MacArthur Study hold Bible. On, hold on, hold on. MacArthur Study Bible. Give me a track. I see I got you some see? questions about this. He said ten minutes. He yeah. set the limit to yeah. ten minutes. But you have We've been answer. going on like half an hour. No. I have answered. I've given you my only answer. I'm going I'm to read to you from and your study Bible. And now he's going Bible. to the MacArthur Study from Bible. The study Bible. Let's study see. Bible. Punishment of ten slaves. minutes, ladies. This is ten minutes. Punishment of slaves is considered the right of the owner. Are you listening, sir? Why did Muhammad, why did Muhammad you, say? See, see, now you don't want to let me no, speak. No, no, no. Why did Muhammad speak, say, don't beat your wife you like you beat your slave? I let you speak. Uh, let me speak. Yeah, now. but you also I said you were going 10 answer. minutes. So you have no. I will this is the matter of no. honor here. No. You said 10 minutes. No. Punishment of slaves was considered the right of the owner. It was the right Just the like having sex slave. with your female slaves and is the right of the owner in Islam. We want to talk about violence. slaves, right? Let's talk about Mary Judges. the Copt, Muhammad's sex slave. He got her pregnant. If How many slaves died, did Muhammad have? A few dozens. Evidence that black order, slaves. No, he had no black slaves. Mary the Copt was from Egypt. Out. Other because than that, he had Anjasha. He had Middan. He had all these slaves. You're because not, he knows. Not, but because he I'm knows not. he's going to throw his own study Bible now. I know. All right, go ahead. Ask your question. Are we good now? Yep. We're going here? We're going here. Okay. I told you we'd go but there. keep in mind. Go ahead. This could have been so calm. I am calm. I'm trying to. If you could, if you could answer, if you could answer and not make up parts of the verses and I make up scholars that don't exist. We talked about it for 10 minutes. Right? Go ahead. See, scholars see, do, see, the scholars look at them. Look at them. Before you. Uh, well, uh, forgetting no. something does not mean you're lying. Okay. Are you right? Like if, sure. you, if you forgot so, the name so of a scholar, you're going to bring me. Deal with it. You're going to bring me the scholar that says that the person would be punished. Just yeah, not, I saw just it in not a lecture. capital there's punishment. A famous, there's a famous a lecture, lecture that all of us watch. By who? Watch. I'm going to get it right All right. I don't remember. Ahead, ask your question. Ask your question, bro. Ask your question now. You see how I'm answering? No dawah dodging This is what I'm answering. I'm not going to jump like he did. Just dodge for 40 minutes. No question answer for 40 minutes. This isn't your time. Science and Islam. Keep in mind, I'm trying to set a good example Me for the too. people watching. You know there are people who just want hostility? I don't want that. They just want anger and hostility? When you're sitting there and you're getting questions... I invited you to dinner at my I'm, house I'm, and then you guys went I'm and made videos up. calling me Fibbin Othman and stuff. Who are you talking about? We were leaving. We were yeah. leaving, right? No, no, but we afterwards, you, you, Sam and them were making videos calling me names... You just they said we were going 10 face. minutes. We went like Go 30 or 40. Okay. Okay. Go ahead. Again. There's a lot of people who want nothing but anger and hostility. I would like. We're going to be calm. Go ahead. Nice, calm, Go ahead. set a good example Ask for Christians and Muslims. All right. Basically, these. Well, we can go through all these depending on how. Uh, how Whichever one you want, Dave. All right, so this is on. You believe that you believe in this because you're handing it out, right? Scientific miracles of the Quran. All right, so this one gives ten. I know there are more, but this me, one gives. Let me ten. answer your question. You just asked a question, right? Okay. Lots of people in this community. I believe the Quran has miracles that science is starting to discover yeah. to show people like that it is a book from a creator. Yeah. Okay. I don't believe the Quran is a book of science, meaning if you want to study biology, I wouldn't say that you should go study the Quran. Okay. But the Quran has many types of miracles. One of them is certain things the Quran has mentioned that the Prophet Muhammad could not have known at that time. Okay. I didn't write this, right? just like you're saying scholars in their opinion. Somebody wrote this. So you might agree with them, you might disagree. I might agree. Okay, so we can just read through them if you, you can say, you can say I like them. Go ahead. Okay, so should we just read them, number one? Whatever origin of life. Is, I'm hear. letting you ask the question, so do what you like. Yeah. So you don't think I'm dodging Origin anything. of life. Origin of life. And I'm just starting here at the beginning. Origin of life. Water is poured out. Wait. Water is pointed out as the origin of all life. All living things are made of cells. And we now know that cells are mostly made of water. Sure. This was discovered only after the invention of the microscope. In the deserts of Arabia, it would be inconceivable to think that someone would have guessed that all life came from water. And then the, the verse is Surah 21, verse 30. And we made every living thing from water. Will they not believe? So, do you okay. agree with that argument? Sure. Okay. Do so you agree that it's miraculous scientific knowledge? Uh, I believe it's yeah, definitely knowledge that the Prophet Muhammad would not have known. Yes. So, all living things are. What did you say? All living thing. We made every living thing from water. Right. Me, like me, every living thing is made from water. What do you mean do I believe that? I, like this is something in the Quran. Okay. And obviously I believe the Quran. So every living I believe thing made it. from water. But if you're thinking like like we take water and suddenly like we shape it into a building or something, that's not what it means. Right? Do you understand what was the first creation? Oh now you're stuck. What if you're talking? <laughs> What's the first creation, bro? If you're talking about, let's see, what are the eternal things? So you've got halal, the word is the pen eternal. Pen eternal. You don't know this? Uh, you're asking. Yeah. It's a question. Okay. 
know there's water. You just asked a question, now you're letting me go, ask. Go, go. That's why we're keeping it civil, man. We're trying to teach you a good example, right? All right. So, the only thing that's eternal is Allah. Not a speech? Mm. Speech is a part of Allah. So anything that's part of Allah is eternal, right? So there's so, nothing else besides that? Nothing is eternal except Allah and His Sifat, whatever okay. belongs to Allah. Okay. The first thing that was created, you with me so far, mm -hmm. is water and the throne. Okay. Now understand something, when we say that water, we don't mean like a river because there's no world, right? This means this is the building blocks of the entire not just the universe, every creation. Okay. Okay. From that, in the way that Allah will, there was gases made, and the heavenly bodies were gases at a time from the water, and then they came to be. And that was the building block of all of creation. Okay. But we don't mean that everything made of water like we took water and made it into a building, right? Just want to be clear. Go ahead. Uh, and it's every living thing, right? Sure. I mean, everything's so, alive in certain ways anyway. So, Angels and jinn are living things, right? Okay. Angels and jinn are made from water? Yes. They're made from water? Yes. Cool. Let okay. me explain how. Right. Okay. This, is, this is why you're... That's, that's why what I'm asking I'm you. You insult me when I ask you. I'm yeah. not yeah. insulting okay. you. I'm saying this is where your brain is going to grow today. Why did you assume I'm insult you? Boom. See? So it done. Don't think bad about okay. me. I'm trying to help you, Dave. Take us, take us through it. Take us hey, through it. Let me just say one thing before I go forward. Out of the three came out, that came out, you're my favorite. Cool, cool, cool. All right, let's go. Take that, Sam and yeah. Anthony. Anna, Anthony. Bunch of losers. Sorry, right. no, no. I didn't call you guys losers, right? I'm not saying I don't like you guys. I just said he, he came out his, to see me the he most. He said it with his eyes. Good. Sam, I got glasses on. Sam, come visit me. Where are you at? Anthony. Quit being scared, Sam. Come visit me. Look like Dave is here. Nobody's. Hey, princess. Are we harming him? Any, anybody hurt you? Look, look, look at his chest, bro. Look at him. Whoa, whoa. Careful. Don't put a knife on and do that, all right? All right. Let's keep going. Right. From water. Go ahead. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala created everything's building block from that original water. From that water, then develop different things. Okay? Like I said, don't take water to be like a river. From that... Sorry, so everything is made from the water. No, I'm, I'm trying to clarify. I didn't understand that Let me that finish. Part. Everything's made from that water. I'll let you. Just, just yes or no. Right. Let me explain it if okay. you don't mind. I, that, I was trying to help you. That's right. So if, if you want to understand, you gotta listen. Yeah, but if you say something, ask. if you say something, I didn't understand it. Then I just asked real quick. If you let me finish, then maybe okay. you would, right? All right. So, and I'm gonna let you ask all your questions. Don't worry. There's okay. no dawa dodging here, bro. No dawa dodging. No dawa dodging. No dawa dodging. No dawa dodging. Dawa dodging. Right? It's Bible dodging, but not dawa dodging. All right. Let's go back. So when Allah made the building block of the universe, water, gases become, for example, planets. Planets then, for example, have wood and things like this, like on Earth, right? Mm -hmm. From that we have fire. It doesn't mean you take water and then suddenly you make it into a mountain. If I was to take, for example, you know the Earth, for example, right? The Earth mm -hmm. comes from what? Like scientists tell us today that a part of the sun or some kind of body came, ripped out and made the Earth, right? Are you getting what I'm saying? Or no? okay. Okay. I'll give you an easier Let's say, a, a, a part of a sun in the universe breaks off mm -hmm. because of a collision. And as it rotates, as it cools, it becomes a planet. Okay? Then on that planet, from that building block, now you get ice on it and water comes. Okay. And then you take that water and you make a drink. And you say, hey, this is originally from that fire. And I tell you, oh, you're saying water is made from fire. No, the Quran is telling you the building block of all of creation was water. But from it then came different elements. From those elements came different elements. From them came a fire that Allah knows best. We don't mean the fire that's in your oven, that Allah made the jinn from. From that came a nur, a light, that Allah then made malaika from that. From them came a thing, a, a, a earth that Allah made in sand from. But if you took it back to the beginning of creation, that would have all come from that original water that Allah created. We have a lesson. I'm trying to help you here, honestly. You can even turn the camera off. I'm just telling you, right? Mm -hmm. We have a lesson on the life of the Prophet. And I know all your little buddies are going to take clips and make fun of it, but I don't mind. Go ahead. Go and watch that video. It talks about the beginning of creation, how okay. everything came from water. If you have, this question would have already been answered, but inshallah, I've answered it now. Next. Okay, so, no, uh, yeah, just, just, just clarify. You're welcome. Now. So, this is about science and Islam. Yeah. And you had, the, you had this uh, passage about the origin of life, everything sure. coming from water. Water, yeah. 
Um, I this one, it, didn't this, I? no. I, I mean, no, no, you explain uh, your views. Okay. That doesn't sound at all like this is what, like, what this I is saying. But what I'm saying is, if you're saying, if you're saying that in the beginning, the first creation is water, and Allah creates water out of, uh, water is H2O. So the position, the position of cosmology is you have this big bang at first, everything is just this, this burst of energy. Then over time, it eventually, it eventually uh, starts forming. Hey, you're back. I guess you didn't have to go, huh? <laughs> it eventually starts forming the lighter elements. Sure. And eventually when you get to oxygen, that's a heavier element. And by the time you actually get chemical bonds like in water, that's going to be way down the road. Sure. So you're saying that science is wrong and that water was at the beginning and that somehow out of water, everything else was formed. But notice, that would be, according to that, that would be massively in conflict with with, si with the modern scientific view, right? Can I respond? What Thank is you. the modern scientific view? What is the modern scientific view? I just, I just, view? I just gave it to him. As far as cosmology, right? Because this is about how uh, sci modern hold science hold is confirming. Hold on a Water came thanks to Jupiter. And that's modern science. First, David, you look surprised. So, water came as all this water on Earth, it came directed by Jupiter on Earth. And that became and started turning around. Interesting. Okay. Let me let, let me let me explain this. Okay. That's the natural. Appreciate it. Okay. Thank okay. You. No. If you look at the fact, first was water. Let me let me explain it, bro. Take it easy. Right? Take it easy. Okay. And and I'll get to your scientific view. I work in the fat industry. Don't worry. I got you, bro. Okay. This, this is you, you're on my. I'm journey. waiting. I'm waiting. I'm waiting. Everything started with water. Everything started with water. Now, what does it tell you here? That. Water is pointed out to the origin of all life. All living things are made up of cells. Do you agree? Yeah. All living things are made out of cells. Do you agree? There are certain things like a, like a virus or something like that. You could question on whether it's alive cells, or yeah. something like that. But yeah, in general, in, in, in general cells. Thank you. So, David, no, some, some viruses are just little, they have to invade cells too. I, that's what I'm, I'm, not, I'm not sure. Some viruses don't have the complete package of what some people consider necessary for life. We're not talking about complete cycle of life. Okay. Everything is made out of cells, yes or no? Uh, David doesn't not know. Not everything is made out of cells, but go ahead. David, when you go living home... Things, living things made out of cells. Yeah, go ahead. And you're it, saying they're... Does a bacteria or a virus have cells or not? A bacteria <laughs> would be a cell. Okay, so <laughs> single, there you go. Single, right. single cell. So, when everything is made out of cells, and, and what is the major component in cells? So you're going to say water, right? I'm asking you, David. Yeah, water. And you're saying that's what that's okay. saying. So that's different from what you were saying. Hold on, bro. Okay. Take it easy. Take a step back. Relax. Just because I'm going to answer, you, doesn't mean you got to get antsy. Okay. We're, we're calm here, right? We're good. We're good. We're good. All right. So you, as David, would have agreed that at least living things are made out of cells, uh -huh. right? Yeah. And you agree that the major component in all cells is water. Yeah. Okay. Sure. So that means the building block of cells is water, right? Mm -hmm. Thank you. Now, when you look at a tree, does a tree have cells? Yes. Does that mean that you took water and made a tree out of it? No. Thank you. So that would mean that the building block of all creation is water. Okay. Right? That does not mean that we took water and transformed it into a tree. Mm -hmm. What the Quran is telling you about the building block of all of living things that you just agreed to the miracle right now by agreeing to these. But let's go, go forward. Do you think the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, would have known that cells make up every living thing? Um, Answer the question, Dave. So we can do your one. No, but I'm still I'm still on right. what that means. I'm getting there. I'm Listen, getting there. I'm no, getting there. No, let me, I'm getting there. Let me just give you my bro, objection. Bro, let me give you my I, objection. I, I heard you. You just talked for like five minutes. Let go ahead. Let me give you my objection. To right? So let this is the some, problem. It's let like let me just say, I'm sitting down because the sunnah. I'm not being disrespectful. Okay. So, speak. I'm listening. God created every living thing from water. Means that cells are filled with water, or that the, the, the main makeup is mostly water, or that everything ultimately comes from water. You also have that He specifically says He created man from water. But then, like in the then in the very next in the very next verse, you guys quote 
We created man from an extract of clay. And you also have, he created man from, okay. you also created man from, you're jumping to the next one. Dust. No, no, I'm not talking about the next one. I'm talking about this one. No, no, I'm not talking, no. But man's Here, creation here's, is not here's the problem, here's the problem. Here's the problem. The Quran says, we created every living thing from water. And you say, what that means is, that cells have a lot of water in them. Cells are the main. I mean, cells, are, cells are filled with water. Yet, right? that's a part of it. So if if we're, if we're taking that as the meaning, then man is made from dust should mean that dust is the main component of man, and man is made from an extract of clay should mean that clay is the main component of man. Otherwise, it's just Allah saying all these different things. Man's made of this. Man's made of that. Man's made of water. Man's made of clay. Man's made of dust. And you're saying, oh. There's a lot of water in cells, so that's what he really means is, is filling us and ignoring everything else. Ignoring everything else. So that's what it looks like. That's what it looks like. You good now? Yeah, good. So good. I good. Good. I'm good. I'm good. I didn't interrupt you at all. And first, another point I'm going to make. I'm really glad that you brought this up because this will be a great dial for people to learn about this. I'll tell you. The first thing, now you see how I'm, I'm with you, so stay with me. Okay? We did agree, David would agree, that every living thing is made out of cells, right? Yes or no? Cells. Okay. Then cells, their major component is water. Yes or no? But you said every living thing. So I'm just, I'm just to you clarify. Said yeah, you just, I said just, just clarify. I'm trying to understand your position. Okay. Angels and jinn would be made of cells as well. Listen, I explained to you my understanding already okay. about where angels. I'm first ta taking you through your train of thought now. Okay. Let's not jump. Here. Right. We're going to talk about that which you can scientifically see and study and all of that, right? So you're saying everything on earth, the living things are made out of cells, right? And those cells, the major component in them are water, right? But the building block, according to David Wood, of all these things that have cells is water, because that's the major component. I'm asking you, do you think the Prophet Muhammad would have known that about cells and cells having water in 6th century Arabia? Absolutely not, but he doesn't say that cells contain Thank water. He doesn't Thank say that at all. Thank you. So you do agree that he would not have known that? He would not have known that. Okay. That's so not for, what him, for him to make a statement that every living thing comes from water, right, would not have known those scientific facts. Today, when we look at it from a scientific perspective, that you can test in a lab. Do you know the scientific method? So we're going to separate between theories and actual things that you can test in a lab, right? Mm -hmm. If you take that, you could say the building block of all, all everything on earth, everything living, are cells which are from water. Today we could make that statement. The Prophet Muhammad would have no idea, but this is what the Quran tells us. Now, let's get to your question. When we say that this is the building block, you said that first came what? Third and whatever, whatever. We said what came first before water? What did you say? What are you talking about? You were saying that according to scientists, before water was what? Yeah, would have just been energy. Okay. Then can you can you scientifically test that in a lab? Uh, no, you cannot. So it's not a scientific fact. Uh, <laughs> that's considered historical historical oh, science. Oh, historical science. So you're saying we now look? He's mocking the scientific I, 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 view. I'm not. That I'm they not. are then going to use to confirm yeah, Islam. I'm not. Again, okay. this is this is where you got caught. You're again. saying water oh, was me, at the beginning. Let me, let me speak. Can you confirm that water was at the beginning? Let, let me speak, and Go I ahead. will confirm what I want to confirm. Listen. I told you about a scientific fact that I can test in a lab. I can take a cell mm -hmm. in a lab and I can look at its makeup and I can tell you how much is water, where is the nucleus, what are the protons, I can do all that in a lab. Mm -hmm. So that is not a theory. I'm not mocking scientific facts. I'm telling you what you're presenting is a theory. Those theories change. Okay. Scientists change. Like the gentleman just mentioned about water coming from Jupiter, right? Which you were not aware of, apparently. Directed, in, by, Jupiter. directed by Jupiter. I wasn't either. So scientists, they make, make these theories. Those theories are not facts, right? So for you to say the Quran conflicts with science because of a theory is incorrect. You are not presenting scientific facts because that which we cannot reproduce in a controlled environment, repeatability, with a hypothesis, you know the scientific method, cannot be taken as fact. Those are theories. And there are different theories of how energy began, how the universe began. There's a Big Bang Theory, not all scientists. Take the Big Bang Theory, you know that, right? So, don't bring theories and present them as facts. Now, what I told you, the building block of all of creation is water. I said it before, I'm saying it again. But 
that building block will go through changes. And I already explained this, but I'm, I'm going to do it again. I'm good with that. In fact, you, your view... You went over it again, fact, so you're not In good. fact, your view is very similar to the ancient Greek philosopher Thales, who said that everything is water. Right? I, 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 I don't know Thales, and the Prophet Muhammad Sallam didn't know Thales, so that's got nothing to do with this conversation. Right? Now, going back to when we talk about an element mm -hmm. that comes, right? That element changes. And then from that change, you make different things. Mm -hmm. so for example, if the building block originally is water, right? From that come planets, they become gases, from the gases, they become planets and universes and things like this. And then they develop into different elements. Okay. We cannot deny the origin of it, okay? Now, science, until now, has not been able to prove the origin of the universe. Okay? Those are theories, okay. and they're disputed, and they're debated, and I attend conferences where, where different PhD researchers debate these theories. Okay? You feel me, bro? Mm -hmm. Right. So, now, what the Quran says, that everything came out of origin, the building block is water, is something that scientists can say at least to a cellular level right now. Okay? Which we agree to. Yeah. Now, can we take it back to the origin of the universe? We as Muslims will say yes, because in the Quran, science hasn't got there yet. When it does, we'll make a new pamphlet and print it for you. Next. Okay, so, well, you didn't answer the one part where I, I said... I thought it was supposed to be quick. Out, well, yeah, we can give... Go ahead. Yeah. So, the basic problem. Uh, every living man is created out of water. And that means his cells, so again, or it you're, means... You're, you're, or it you're, means you're, you're switching to man's creation. That's a different type of water. I didn't get there yet. We're just okay. talking about every living thing. Original okay. building block. But right man now. is made out of clay, and man is made out of dust. You want to get to that? So does that mean that man is mostly composed of dust and mostly no. composed of clay? No, because the building block for clay and dust and everything before it's creation water. was water. H two O. Again, you, you're putting you're putting a a, a physical uh, uh, what's that what's that chart? Called? That's not a theory. You can test that in a lab. Water is H two O. Yes. You're talking about an elemental chart today. Mm -hmm. right? We're talking about the building blocks before there was a universe. Mm -hmm. So what type of water was that? Allah knows best. This is before the elements were even created. Right? Mm -hmm. But even today, scientists will tell you that the building block of a cell is water. Right? Now, what was what was the compound of that water when it was first developing all of creation? I don't know because the elemental chart didn't exist. That would have been water, unless you're saying it was some other kind of water. Like, but what, so, now, so, let me, let me so explain that to you again, then, because What's apparently like, you, know, you didn't listen to it. Do right? you believe water can made out, be made out of other stuff? So listen, we are looking at an elemental chart okay. in, on the planet Earth in this time. right? Mm -hmm. We're talking about a building block. Okay. But you know that different hydrogen, for example, have different components, but are still considered hydrogens, right? Those elements are still being discovered. Like we have new elements we discover, we assign them letters. No, all hydrogen has one one proton. Uh, you can what, what if you add to it? If you add, add another proton, then or, it or add helium. Add if you add another proton, okay. it becomes helium. Helium. Yeah. What is helium? It's still a gas, right? Yeah. Thank you. So these are gases. Okay. Right? So are there liquids, right? Which would be under the uh, components, for example, of water that would be building blocks of water that we don't know about, right? Because this is, again, before the universe was even created. Okay. Would you agree that's possible? I would say you can have another liquid. It wouldn't be water. And if you, but if you're but, saying, but if your you're saying, if you're, if, from if you're saying that it's some other water, some different kind of water, sure. and what Allah is saying is that we come from that different kind of water, and this is confirmed by science. No, science, the cell, your cells have H two O in form of. Let me repeat that a third electrolytic. time. Electrolytic. I got you. Let me repeat it a third. Time. Okay. The original creation, before there was an elemental chart, before there was creation, before there were universes, before there were planets, before there was, when there was nothing, there was water. The Arsh of Allah was in water. What was the elemental property of that water? I don't know. It's not in the Quran. We don't know. From that became gases. Mm -hmm. right? And the heavenly bodies were gases until Allah ordered them to come together. Mm -hmm. okay? Then they became planets. From those planets, different elements developed in that planet. Okay? From that original creation, one of the elements of that water is what you consider water today that you're drinking. Right? If you're asking me that this water today that our cells are made of, is it the exact same element 
as the original, I just told you, I don't know. But that water was the building block, and today this water that came from it is the building block of yourselves. And that's something the Prophet Muhammad would not have known. But when he mentioned it, today scientists, listen, I'm trying to help you here, but I see your face, you're not trying to take this, but it's all right. I'm listening, I, this I was, is just shocking. I was, I'm glad, I'm glad. I was speaking to a PhD scientist myself, right, about this verse, right, when I was at a, a conference. Okay. And he, as a non-Muslim, an atheist, he was telling me, he goes, today as a scientist, I could make the claim that the building block of all living things is water. What, what scientist but, was his name? Who was his, name his name was David Ecker. Doctor, David? Doctor David Ecker. Can you spell that last name? E-C-K-E-R. I'll wait till the next level. Every, the building blocks of what? All living, okay, living. things. That's, that's what we can test, right? He's not going to talk about jinn and malaika. See, now, now when I named him, he got, you thought I couldn't name him. <laughs> no, no, <laughs> like no. You I, I was, yours, right? No, I thought you were saying. You. I got you. I got you. Dr. David Ecker. Okay. Fire door handle. Oh, so your little friends? <laughs> what? <laughs> read it, read it, read it. Sheikh Uthman, we know your car. We know your house. Stop Dawa or die, Saints of Sam. Where was this? Cars door handle. Can we see that? Can spell Dawa wrong? Can we spell Uthman wrong? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I went to the car to go get some uh, Whoever put this on my car, um, first thing, my name is spelled with a T-H. <laughs> Second thing, uh, you, 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 the shake is not, even David wouldn't know you didn't spell shake right. And you spell Dawa wrong. This is Dua. <laughs> Keep this, but uh, uh, you know what? We'll deal with this later. Okay, go, ahead. go ahead. You can check that for fingerprints, by the way. Uh, Although mine are on it now. So. <laughs> David would put it on there! <laughs> all right, guys. All right, so. We don't care about their fingerprints. We don't care about their threats. You guys can threat all you want, but that was not stopping. All right, so just to, just to recap. The Quran says that all living things uh, come from water. Um, it does say that man comes from, man comes from clay, man comes from dust. Jinn are from fire, angels are from light, but they, since water was the first created thing, everything ultimately comes from that. But according, according to the modern scientific picture, water is composed of H2O, which comes pretty far down the, the, the chain of history. But we don't know that that is correct because it's not something we can test in a lab. And historical science would be in the realm of theory. Maybe the original water had some different chemical composition. We don't know. But it ultimately became the water today. Living cells today. So today's water comes from that water and everything else. And you think that science would confirm that picture? If you're saying will science confirm that the originals, origins of the universe were from water and what element that was, science cannot because science uses the scientific method. And the scientific method is you put a hypothesis and you take it in a controlled environment and you test it. Right? Can we test the beginning of the universe in a controlled environment? No. So science can have theories. What science, a scientist, and I named him for you, and he's actually a subscriber to our channel now, which is what he said is that today as a scientist, as an atheist scientist, I can look at the components of all living things, the cells, and make a claim from a scientific perspective, not a religious perspective, that the building block of all living things is water. And he said that I am shocked as an atheist that how can a man in a desert make such a claim? Which is one of the miracles of the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, which is a miracle of the Quran. And I appreciate David bringing dawah out to everybody else. If he said the building block, that would be incoherent, nonsense. You need a lot of things. It isn't going to give you DNA. That's not going to give you, it's not going to, it's not going to give you mitochondria, all the other parts that you need for let me, cells. Let me again explain that to you because, you, no. When you talk about a, a component, which is a building block, it will, so, for example, this building, mm -hmm. right? What is the building block of this building? Cement. Uh, yeah, right? Does that mean those windows are made out of cement? Does that mean cement by itself will give you electricity? Does that mean cement by itself? No, you mean the major component of the building is cement. Okay. That's what he said, and that is correct, okay. and you would agree to it. So, man is made of water means that the main the main building block no, of man no, no, is water. But all living things, all living things. So the main, man is a living thing. If the, if the main building block of all, of all living things 
is water, then the main building block of man is water. But the Quran also says that man was made from clay and man is made from dust. Therefore, to be consistent, we would have to say that the main component of man is dust, and we also have to say the main component of man is clay, and therefore we just have an incoherent picture. It looks like what you're doing is, is sort of like, Allah says all these things, let me pick the one and then ignore the others, which would be completely inflicted. Do you actually believe that scientists one day are going to find out that clay is the main component of man? This is the fourth time I'm repeating. This I, don't, I didn't catch it earlier. This is why everybody in the video will catch when we say man came from clay, or jinns came from fire, or manaika came from moon, or, or, or sand, cement comes from sand and so on, you're talking about the later development of elements, right? Mm -hmm. As I said, the original element that developed everything in the universe was water. Then that water, Different chemical compound though, right? Not necessarily. Okay. I did not say that, right? But if I, it was I, the same, I, then H2O is at the beginning. This, I, <laughs> this, is, this is again like the I'm just fourth trying to, time. I'm just trying to clarify. But I've said it four times, this is the fifth now, right? I am not making a claim of the elements table compound of what that original water was. I'm not saying it wasn't for H2O, and I'm not saying it was, because that's not in the Quran, and that is not something I can test. Mm -hmm. Okay? But water was the original building block of all of creation. Mm -hmm. That water then, the elements developed from it. One of the elements that we know that developed from it was the earth, right? Original building block was there. Then from that earth, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala took different parts of the earth, made the building block of the, of the human being. There is no contradiction here, right? Because that original element is there. And that element developed into what is water today. Whether it can, this water that me and you are drinking is the same on the, on the elements charge or not from that original, neither me and you can have an answer because it's not in the Quran. The Quran doesn't talk about elemental charge, nor can we go back and test it. But what we can say, did I clarify that for you this time? Right, now, yeah, when, you talk about, you guys when you talk about insan coming from water, you want to talk about that now, or clay, or dirt? No, uh, well, uh, okay. uh, it's, it's fine. If you want to say clay, that. if you want to say clay and dust ultimately came from water, uh, yes. uh, one, using your interpretation, if man being created from clay means that clay is somehow the main component, then we should find clay in the human body. We do not find clay. We do not find clay. But if you're saying, no, no, if you're saying, if you're saying, you can, you can, you can. If you're saying that. The water that this is talking about is some primordial water that I'm became saying, anything. You have to, then you could re you could study the body and find I'm that it's made of anything. If you found out that the body was made of lead, then you could say, well, the lead ultimately came from water. Alhamdulillah, that's the clear proof, right? So you're, if, by, by saying that there's this original water, which we don't know what the composition is, you're saying we're pushing this completely outside the realm of test testability. And so there's nothing that confirms it. If you say, ah, we found water in it. Well, according to you, if we'd found if we found gold inside there, the gold came from the water, and therefore it's miraculous confirmation. So what you're saying is, whatever man is made of, it confirms that it's made from water, which no scientist would agree that water was the fundamental building block at the original, at the original origin of creation. It sounds like what you said. Let me explain it again. Six times. Now, when you say that the building block, right, we're talking about that. Can you take a, a cell and say that iron is the building block, is the majority component of the cell? No, but if, 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 you could not. If, that's what you, if, if, you, if you mean majority component, then man, the majority component is clay, and it's not. The majority component is dust, it's not. So the point is, you can't take it to mean majority component. You don't want to answer. I'm saying, I'm saying I don't see how you say this. Let me tell you. Okay. Majority component of human beings is clay, confirmed by science, according to Sheikh of Mud. You said that's what it means to be created from. I did not. I did not. Look, I'm just glad that we have this recorded. I'm glad we have this recorded. Now listen. Would you agree that the majority component of not just man, but all living things, ourselves, 
Okay. Yeah. Yes. In that cell. Not angels or gin. Well done. Even though you, you have to. Now. Have you? Have you tested angels or gin? I don't believe you have to. No, but you. Okay. okay. So so angels and gin are composed of cells I that ultimately come from water. I did not say that. Cells I have, I have that come from fire and from light you that ultimately come from water. Although we don't know what the water is. You see it. You see it. You're playing to the camera. Go ahead. How do I know? You go ahead. I'm just repeating. No, no, no. You, you're playing to the camera. You're is not any of this scientifically testable? That's what I'm asking. He says, "Aha! There's water in cells. Is there clay in cells? Is there dust? What, 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 what are you saying?" I'm telling you. So, so you see this? Man is talk to me. Talk to you. Water. He wants to talk to you, so go ahead. Talk to the because camera. Because you just repeat yourself, even though I'm telling talk you exactly what's happening. Go ahead. Okay. Go ahead. So, man is created from water it means that the fundamental component of man's cells is water. But it also says man is created from dust, man is created from clay. Is the main component is the main component clay and dust? No. So, should you be translating created from as the fundamental component of you is this? No. Why does he choose that there? He chooses that there because scientists eventually found that there's a lot of water in cells, right? So, aha, that's what he meant there. Was well, that what he meant when he said we're made from clay? No. Is that what he made from me? meant when he said we're made from dust? No. What about angels and jinn made from uh, light and fire? Well, the light and fire ultimately comes from water. But guess what? If you're talking about some primordial other element or whatever that's not actually H2O, then it's not confirmed. It's not confirmed by us finding water in your cells today. And by the way, side point, if you go to Muhammad's companions, if you go to the tafsir of Ibn Abbas, they interpreted every living thing made from water as the substance of the male and female. So even Muhammad's companions disagree with you. I'm waiting for you to speak. We're good, we're good, we're good. Are you done playing to the camera? But I think you're gonna repeat yourself start talking about the original stuff, which we already know. We already know Are you done playing to the camera? Yeah. You wanna do some more? No, I'm gonna do some more later. You can make some clips for yourself. You like some water? <laughs> that component that you're made out of? So what's, what's the difference between this water and the water you drink? Hmm? What's the difference between this water? How does life come out of those? There might be some different electrolytes in there, but they would all be H2O. So drink with your right hand. <laughs> all right. Let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me. What if I, what if I use my right hand for no problem? Then you're nasty, bro. All right, let me, let me keep going. Wash it. Right. You wash? Yeah. You make a stinja? I wash. I'm glad you do, man. You learned something good from Islam. All right. Let me take it back now. Okay. Now that you're done with your, with your, with your clips that you want to make, mm -hmm. let's talk. All right. So, did I say anything? about the building black block of clay. Did I even know the Quran that? did. No, but, but did, I, your, did, did, did I, hold the way hold you're the way hold you're that. interpreting hold everything that. made of water David. would mean you hold have to be consistent. Hold that. Okay. Take it easy. Take it easy. I told you earlier, do you want me to talk about how insan was made and you wanted to continue here about all living creatures. And then you went and turned to your camera and said, Sheikh Uthman is saying this and saying this and saying this. And those are things I did not say. Your viewers what can did I watch. Say that was wrong? Let me tell you. I did not say that clay being the major building block of insan. Because when we say insan was made from clay, we're not. When, what, what is meant by insan? But you would have to say can that I, about can man. Can I finish? You can I say, finish? Can I finish, David? Yeah. But I let you talk to your camera for like I don't know how long and look, I stayed quiet. I just want you to clarify. Let, you wouldn't even let me speak. If you say, you know, if you you say know all I'm men are moral, you you're not going to correct and you know, me. Go okay, ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Let me speak then. Thank you. I thought we were keeping it civil, Dave. Dr. Wood. Now, when we talk about insan here, what you don't understand, when you say tafsir ibn Abbas, you don't even know what ibn Abbas wrote. Because you, instead of asking, are claiming you know. Right? There is no book from ibn Abbas radiallahu anhu. The tafsir of Ibn Abbas is collected. There is one book printed later where people put his tafsir together, which is mostly weak ahadith. If you, want, if you came to my library, I would have taught you this, but you didn't. Now, let's go back to this. When we talk about insan here, the reference is to Adam. But you didn't know that. You went on this whole rampage not knowing that, which I could have helped you go off on. We are not saying as Muslims that David Wood was clay and then he became this person. No, insan here is a reference to Adam. See, see, if you had just listened, right? So now all of that stuff that he was saying that, oh, human's main component should be should be clay then. We don't claim that because in San, if you had read the actual tafsir, the reference there is to Adam. 
Adam was created in a unique way, that we are not created that way. We are created through the coming together of another ma. Ma here also has, when you're talking about insan's creation, Ibn Abbas radiallahu anhu, now the tafsir comes in, but if you had just listened, you wouldn't have made a fool out of yourself here, right? When we're talking about the entire creation... was mostly insults, by the way. It is not. It is not. This, this is, this is nasiha. This is sincere advice. You just don't take it that way, right? You want to throw, now, you want to throw look, Ibn Abbas's look, commentary? I am not. I'm not. You don't understand Ibn Abbas. That's what I'm trying to explain to you. Ibn Abbas is talking about the ma here, not in reference as the building block of the universe. When, see, this is why you well, don't understand right, he, the he, Arabic he, he, he language. Said, he no, says you don't that, listen. You he don't says listen. that in reference to every listen. living thing created of what? No, he Talks doesn't. No, he does it? not. You feel like they, what they, book is this in? It's in the, the, the tafsir of it. Google it. Look at it. Okay. You are saying that Ibn Abbas says that all living things yeah, are made from hum, human, human sperm. The game. You never play the game again. He says, he says the, <laughs> man, the water from the male and female. Uh, so the water, the from, water the from the male, male and female, female the building block of trees. All they living things. Like Come on, Dave. That's what he says. Come on, Dave. Find okay. it. Find Everyone's it. Everyone's making fun. Everyone's making fun. All right. Find it. What percent of the water is in a cell? It's like a letter from the I know who I'm here for now. And so this is See, this is why you were talking to the camera instead of me. Hmm? Because, because you know how it didn't tell you. He's not overcoming his fear of living. He's only yeah. overcoming his physical dependency. But the other people, man, they have a fear of like, what am I going to do for the next 60 years? And I'm just letting you know that don't then say, Osman is running. By the time it's finished at 5, that's how I do every Sunday. David can be here all the way that I'm here. Thank Don't try to make false claims that Osman ran them. I'm giving you a head, heads up. So most of these people that receive living like normal... Let him, let him, let him, let him find, let him find it. Let him find it. Asking the question. And they don't start thinking about this. This is the problem with Google scholars, right? They don't look at the context. They don't look at the actual book. They don't look at which ayah is being referenced. They don't look at the authenticity of the narration. They don't look at the fact that Ibn Abbas was talking about it's the water that insan like is made from. Like the reference of the, the word ma in Arabic can reference sperm like as they, well. They, they and this is looking at a different time. If you don't know the Arabic language, you don't know the context, you don't like know the tafsir, then you make a fool out of yourself. I'm not saying you're a fool, like but you do realize that you didn't make a fool out of yourself but instead of asking, making comments that you didn't know about. I am really glad you came back to me. Adam lived 960 years. Oh, here we go, here we go. Here we go. Have not those who disbelieve in Muhammad, peace be upon him, and the Quran, known that the heavens and the earth were of one piece, we did not send down a drop of rain or grow vegetation on the earth, which were aligned with each other, then we parted them, and then separated them and singled them out from each other. And the commentary on, and we made every living thing of water, is we made of water from the male and female everything that requires water. The male and the female. So it's the male and the female water. This is what I was telling you, bro. This is what I was telling you that you, you if you had asked, then I would have explained. I said this earlier in the video, so don't act like I'm saying this now. Okay, this is why I'm glad this is recorded. What is this from? Ibn Abbas. <laughs> Did Ibn Abbas write a tafsir? No, you can say you can say you can say that's wrong. Can, can so I someone made you, that up about Ibn Abbas. Did Ibn Abbas, radiyallahu anhu, write a tafsir? Um, no, so this is, you went, we just say, attributed to Ibn Abbas, Hold on. collected take it later. Easy. Take it easy, Dave, we're going to walk you through so that next time you'll be more educated. Like, this is really me trying to help you. I could make fun of this, but I'm not. I'm trying to help you, okay? When you talk about the Tafsir Ibn Abbas, okay? I have a video, you can go on the Majdribad channel, that I talk about different books of Tafsir. This is a book that was compiled later. What website is this from? Read the website's name. Al-Bayat.org Who's Al-Bayat.org? Dave, the website you're depending on. He's making fun. No, 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 I'm not making fun. He's making fun of the Tafsir of Ibn right here. I am not making fun. Again, don't lie, bro. We're trying to be honest. Whose website are you depending on for this quote? This is a Shia website. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Oops, oops. David did it again. No. This is not an Ibn Abbas. Again, Ibn Abbas never wrote a book. 
We have Tabari, we have Ibn Kathir, we have those books that bring forth. Wait, wait, hold on. Let me get my phone. Go ahead. Go ahead. Bro, you can, let me just explain this to you so that you don't Google another Shia website. Again. So if I got other commentaries, we're not going to find this. Hold on, right? Let me explain this. There is a book, Al Miqtabas, the Tafsir Ibn Abbas, which I have commented for all the weak narrations that were misreferenced. The correct reference of the Abbas regarding Al Ma here, and I'll, if you'd like, like, like I, I said, I mean, like not today because I have some uh, stuff. Next time you come, you, you never give me advance notice, you do. I'll invite you to my library with or without cameras, and I'll show you that this reference is to the ma, the water that creates humans, not the one that created the universe. So when we talk about al ma in Arabic, not elements here, one of the references to that is to sperm. That's why the Prophet in the authentic hadith said, when the water comes out, then ghusl is obligated. You understand? So, here the water word, and this is not something we made up later. This is from a hadith of the Prophet Here water is a reference to two sperm. Otherwise, when water comes out, we don't have to go make ghusl. That has to do with jama'ah or intercourse, right? So Ibn Abbas is talking about, when you talk about the building back block, for human beings who were created, then the water in reference there is the sperm. When we talk about water as a building block for all of the universe, for all of the things, then you know Ibn Abbas doesn't mean that a male and female sperm was there before the universe. You know that. That's why when you just Google random shit inside, I'm not interpreting. Here's the thing. No, no, no. But this is the problem. You just talked for like five minutes. Can I just finish? Okay, go ahead. If David Wood was really wanting to learn, which I hope you are, right? and we get a lot of people commenting and things saying that you're very sincere coming out here, I hope you are, then instead of coming and kind of talk to your camera and debate, you would have asked me, said, hey, offline, hey, just want to know, is this quote from Ibn Abbas authentic or not? And I could have brought you the books like I do with everybody else and said, hey, here is the chain, here is why it's weak, here is who strengthened it, here is what happened, here is what books it is, and then you wouldn't have made this fool out of yourself. I'm not saying you're a fool, I'm just saying that you would have learned. I'm right? a fool because I went to the top seat. Again, again, you made a fool out of yourself because you Googled the Shia website and found the no, incorrect reference. That's Al Tafsir. That's Al Tafsir. Th that's Ahlul Bayt. I just had you read it. Yeah, yeah. The <laughs> website is Al Tafsir. Yeah. But where does it pull from? Al Tafsir.com. I just had you read yeah, the yeah, website ahlulbayt.org. Okay. The you're, 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 you're saying, the you're saying that in the Sunni, if I grab a Sunni copy of Ibn Abbas, that won't be in there. There is no Sunni Shia copy of Ibn Abbas. There is no book written by Ibn Abbas. There is a book called Al-Iqtifaz, so Tafsir Ibn Abbas, I believe that's I'm saying right. if I get a, a, a Tafsir published by Su a Sunni press, okay. it's not going to have that in there. Let me explain it a third time. Don't, don't think about your, your response, just listen. Okay? If you look at the Akhwal of Ibn Abbas, right? and you go to the books of Tafsir that check the chain authentically, okay? this Tafsir comes under the ayah regarding how insan is made out of man. Not under... I, I, I got all that. You got all that? Yeah. So, let's do this. If you don't, if you want. And I'm saying this, you can turn the cameras off. Email me personally, and I will, anytime you're confused about this, I will check a chain, I will send it to you, and then you can know what's authentic and where it should be, not Shia Sunni, the authenticity of the chain. Mm -hmm. And then you wouldn't make claims that don't exist next time. How about that? Well, the, the, the claims do exist. Okay. You, At best case scenario, you could say someone else came came up with it later or something like that. But that's right? not a claim but that, that still I made. Means, yeah, yeah, but that's, that's not a claim Ibn Abbas that's still, made. Still, uh, because that's, that's yeah. still, I just that told still you became you a claim, know. and it's as reasonable as any so, interpretation. Listen, listen, listen. listen, listen, listen. Hold, no, 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 no. You made a comment. Now I gotta explain. Tomorrow, some Qadiani, Ismaili, Shia, uh, NOI, any other sect can write a book and publish it online, yeah, yeah. and David Wood will expect that that is authentic. But this is where your mistake is. We as Muslims, we have a sign to check a hadith. Last time you came and came the hadith was in Tirmidhi, and it wasn't, right? Yeah. You guys went home and found. That this, hadith even, this hold is, on, hold on, hold This is beside the point. No, it's not. That is the point. That instead of asking, why is this me? I'm here what? asking. No, no, you're not. You didn't come and ask me, hey, did Ibn Abbas say this? You, 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 you say it's me. So I'm telling you, not only is it we, but it is misreference. And I'm giving you an offer for the future that when you're confused about us about a source, you can reach out to me without trying to make a show out of it, and I will help you 
by letting you know the authenticity and weakness mm -hmm. so that you will know that before you come out and make your show. Yeah. Would you okay. like that? Yeah, no, but here, here, here's the, here's the no, problem. No, you wouldn't like Here's that. the problem. <laughs> when the Quran says man's created from water, and I say, what does that mean? And I'll say, exactly. ah, and so, I'll say, what does that mean? Yes. And the answer is, ah, what it means is that the water of the man, yeah, the yes. sperm, yes. the sperm uh, for, it. forms man, right? Good. Yes. It says, man comes from water. Yes. Then I read, every living thing comes from water. Yes. Okay, so if, if that's what it means for something to come from something, Let me explain it to you. It's like Allah said, again, Perfect. Allah says all these things come from these things. So you don't want to listen and to then, But you jump in with the interpretation, right? You see what I'm saying? We don't. You, you this, do. this is the problem. Let me okay. explain it to you. In the tafsir, mm -hmm. we have certain rules. Okay? You're going to learn today, Dave, right? right? There are six abwab of tafsir. Six methods of tafsir. We can't make up our own interpretation. Right? Do you know those six? No, I don't. You know, You're going to learn them today. Okay? Are we really going to spend time on this? Yes, because this is why you're confused. One is tafsir of Quran bil Quran. When the Quran explains itself, yeah. okay? so we take an ayah and another ayah that references that ayah. For example, when you say "Ghair al-Maghdubi alayhim," there's a hadith on that. When you say "An'amta alayhim," there's an ayah on who those are. Right? So I'm, this is a little advanced for you, but just for help benefit you. Right? From them is tafsir of hadith from the Prophet. From them, so here, when you say "man is come from water," the Prophet Muhammad explained what it meant by water. So when we find the authentic hadith from the Prophet then we explain that ayah in that way. When you say all of creation came from water, the Prophet Muhammad explained that ayah by telling us that there was Allah and there was nothing with Allah. And then Allah made the arsh and then there was water and then the first thing that was created after that in the tablet and pen and so on. So when the Prophet explains the ayah, then we take that context, check the authenticity and then we explain it accordingly. You see, clear up. Hey. Cleared up. Cleared up. Go ahead, go ahead. Speak and to what the we've got Speak cleared up here. You don't want to talk to me. Speak so to we the read. We Let's read here. I'm making a Big video. Clips. I'm making a video. You're making it. It's not a conversation. Yeah. He can't even make a video. So he didn't ask about that. The claim. Not, the claim, claim here was that this is a miraculous, a miraculous statement in the Quran that every living thing was made from water. But when we ask what that really means, at first it's, but there's so much water in the human body. But when we actually examine true. it, we find that water was the first thing that was made. Yes. We have no idea whether it was H2O or not. This picture completely conflicts with the modern scientific picture, which he says not. cannot be true. That is not. That, yeah, yeah. That is, that's a theory. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It, it conflicts with the modern scientific picture. And it doesn't mean many, I did not say there it's true. are many theories. No, there is no, there, there is no modern theory no that other, says that at the beginning no, 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 was this are water. Are there multiple theories about the beginning of the universe? Yeah, none of them Thank start you. with water Thank as you. the none fundamental those, building block. You, you're taking a scientific theory. You're, you're claiming like it's, it's confirmed it's by science. Not. Yes. Okay. Because, so what, what is the original water? What is I'll just stick with what you said. What is confirmed? What is confirmed is there that the human and all living things their cell are majority water. And that means this is the building block of, of all living things. You agreed to that. And that is it. To say that that original water, what stages it went through and so on, we do not claim and no scientist has claimed as a fact. You know that and you know there are different theories, but now because you're caught, you just want to speak to your camera instead of talking to me. I'm you just see, trying, he didn't come I'm to learn about that one. This is I'm not that one. No, no, no. I want to, to be clear. I session. want to be clear. You want if me to he talk? came to ask about this to me, he would be talking to me. What he came to do is to make a here. video so he can raise his money so you can support him. So I'm going to let him do that. Go ahead. It's all about money. It's all about money. Listen, you, I don't take a penny. Do the same so, thing. Challenge right now. This is All the Dawa Dodge. Stop the Dawa taking Dodge. money so, from your own just to from, recap, from people. Come just and to do recap. this for the sake of Allah or your God Jesus. The amazing, we'll the amazing confirmation is that cells contain mostly water as the yes. fundamental building block. And when Allah says every living thing came from water, that's what He meant. Even though, according to Sheikh Uthman, that's not what He meant. What He means is everything in creation ultimately comes from water. Yes. Rocks. Clay, Everything. bricks, gold, Rocks different elements. Cells? Even if they don't have, even if they don't have H two O, they ultimately come from that primordial whatever it was. Even whether whether it's H two O or not. Well, if that's all you're saying, then cells containing water is not confirmation of that because it, it might not even be the same substance according to Sheikh Uthman. Moreover, moreover, when I we look at the Quran's that. other other claims that. about man coming from clay, man coming from dust. 
Following the same level of interpretation, we should say that the fundamental building blocks of man are clay and dust. No, 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 that's not what we mean there. That's not what it means there. Notice, it's we take all these claims of Allah and then we decide what Allah means after the fact. Based where do we hadith. find where do we find predictions based on these? I predict that one day scientists will find that man is made of clay as the fundamental building block. They don't say there's 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 none of that. Imagine and notice that. here's the problem. The here's the problem. Sahaba here's the problem. Saying, I predict the scientists and they will tell you what's a scientist? Well, here's we'll the problem. predict that building blocks made of there's no word for cells. Selective, this, this, selective this, this, this interpretation. In they wait for it scientists to make it the discovery, and then they, they look through the Quran and find no, where they can quote mine. When we look that at what the Quran the actually name, says, agree, a man in a desert could not have made such a claim. That's he what could, he put it no one could have claimed that, that, all, that everything that comes from water, even though that's what the great philosopher Thales said. Okay, now, no now one could have said it. Thales, Thales was, was, was inspired by God. He's inspired by God because well, of a miraculous prediction. Was an illiterate man in the desert. You know, you're, you know, you're making this up now. You know that he studied, he looked at the elements, and the Prophet was an illiterate man in the desert that couldn't read or write. Now forget about Greek. You know that. You, no, no, you know that. You know, you know that they that. traded. You, you, you Muhammad know didn't know that. anything about what other people knew. He could not read. So when, when he, he, he you don't no, need no, to. Wait, it's an oral wait, wait, culture. Wait, you, no, you, you don't need you it. You don't need question. it. It's an oral culture. You ask the it's an oral culture. In the oral culture, was any work of the Greeks translated to be read in Arabic, orally? You don't can need you prove it because it. people can translate. <laughs> okay, can so, you prove so, it? So when, when, when let's listen. I'll prove you wrong right here. When Muhammad says. That he's about to he's about to make a rule about um, sex with nursing mothers or something like that, and he says I was about to I was about to rule against it, but I know that what do you say the Romans and the Persians or something like that they do it and they don't have any problems from it, so I'm not going to make a ruling against it. Show me this the means hadith. this oh, means. Hold on, hold on. Show me the hadith so we can look at the wording because you're just making it up on top of your head. Let, let me see the hadith and let me let me ask this now. I'm not saying the hadith doesn't exist. I'm okay. saying I'm saying. Saying, if somebody says that people have intercourse uh -huh. with women that are nursing uh -huh. and there's no harm that comes to the uh -huh. child, that is not the same as getting Thelos, what was the name of the guy? Thales. The, the Thales. Thales. Getting Thales' Greek theory of the origin of mankind and translating. You, you know those are apples and oranges, for example. No, it means, it means, it means they're, they're all talking about issues. I don't know what I don't know what in the world any of these people are doing with suckling wives or anything. I have no idea. If I'm familiar with that, that means I'm getting a lot of information from other cultures. Let me tell you. Let me tell you. Okay. For example, if you say there are people in Pakistan that make guns in their in their uh, homes, right? Like in the Fata area, right? That there are people that you hear about that they make guns at home, right? Does that mean that you know what Iqbal's poetry is? No, it means that they yeah, are communicating uh, 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 and you can't okay, rule it out. Did, did you hear what I said? Did you hear what I said? Answer my question. Listen. If listen, you're saying listen, I couldn't possibly have heard this listen, or known this, listen, and it's an oral culture, again, and they're again, talking about all kinds again, of things from completely different again, cultures, again, you can't rule that out. Again, With that said, again, I don't care what Thaley said. Again, you said it's impossible for sure. someone to claim that. Thaley's claimed that. That was that was the only response. I was I, not claiming I, that Muhammad I, I, got it right. Okay, you're not claiming. No, I'm not claiming. How would Good. I know? How would Good. I know? Good. I'm saying Good. that someone's saying. I'm saying if that's miraculous confirmation of Muhammad, how's it not miraculous confirmation of Thaley? Let me tell you, because Thaley was a literate philosopher in the hub. How would he know? Hold on, hold, How would on, he know? hold on, hold on. Let me finish now. Thales was a literate scholar in the hub of a place of learning. The Prophet Muhammad was an illiterate man in a desert who couldn't read or write Arabic, let alone Roman or Latin or Greek or any of it. The fact that he may have known about trade routes and what's going on does not mean that he knew about the philosophy of those cultures or be able to read their theory. This is why it's miraculous. This is why if the Quran was revealed to Thales, it would not be miraculous because you could have said that he made it up. And that's why Allah chose an illiterate man in a desert in a hub that was not a hub of philosophy. It was not a hub of learning. It was a hub of, of Bedouins that didn't have a king. And Allah chose that prophet to reveal the Quran to to show that he could not have come up with it. This is from Allah. And, 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 and how did he show it? By saying that man is made finish. of all kinds of things you don't let me and then picking one. You pick don't want to let, let me finish. Right. When you say man, uh -huh. I've already corrected you, but you don't want to hear. This is this is why I'm saying it again. When you're talking about that, all of creation uh -huh. is created from 
water. But not right? H2O. Hold on, hold on. I'm not saying it was or wasn't H2O because I cannot make a claim. If you're saying it might not, if you're saying it might not be, then there goes the confirmation. Scientists are talking about H2O. If you're saying something else, there's no confirmation. Let me tell you. There's no confirmation. Let me tell you. If you're just going to repeat something you said an hour ago, then can I finish? See what you know why you're interrupting me now because you know why I got. It. No, this so, is this is. So let, let me finish. Let it's me water, finish. but it's not water. Let me finish. Go ahead. I did not say it's water, but it's not water. You asked me, is that original water H two O? All I said is I cannot make a table of, of elements claim like right now, for something that I don't have in the Quran. The Quran does not say H two O yes or no. Right? I am giving my knowledge from the inspirational line. I'm not making my own up. Right? I did not say it's a different water. I did not say it's not H2O. I just said I cannot make that. But it is water. And no doubt that our cells are made of water. And no doubt that it's a miracle that a man and a death. And that's only one thing. Like there's linguistic, historic, there's tons of miracles. But that's a miracle. Let me finish. It's a miracle, let me, ladies. So you're not letting me finish. And see who he's speaking to? He's speaking to you because he just wants to make videos. He doesn't want to speak to me. It's a miracle. Go ahead, go ahead. Speak to your camera. Go ahead. I want them to hear that. Yeah, you know why you want them to hear? Because you know that you're getting answers. Man is made of clay. You're man, made of, man is made of clay. Clay is not dust, and yet man is made of dust. Dust is not is. water, and yet man is made of water. Again, what do these things I mean? Well, everything is water, water, even though we don't know it's H2O, and <laughs> this is before everything. So whatever you believe, Big Bang or whatever, water is the first thing created. Somehow this yes. becomes the entire universe, Building block and what the Quran really means when it says that man is, uh, that, that all living things are made of water is this primordial stuff, but that has nothing to do with what's in your cells, because again, your cells could be filled with gold. He would still say that ultimately comes from water, not, and therefore gold it would be- cannot be called water. But he, it, it, it ultimately again, it still me, comes me, from water. It all comes again. from water. We let know me, it so doesn't no, become. So it comes from you're, water. You're just talking to them. You don't right? believe that it all let comes me, from water? Let me let me explain it again, right? Because because you're just talking to, to your to making your videos and you're not trying to learn, right? When man is made of water, the prophet Sallallahu Alaihi explained that. When universe is made by water, what is meant? The prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi explained that. When we talk about the universe being made of water, the prophet Muhammad, not me, Alayhi Salatu Salam, explained that to say that before. There was nothing, only Allah. Then Allah had the arsh and water, and from that element of water, then after that, then the creation began, and the Prophet then said, then it became gas, and the, 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 the Quran then tells you that the universe of gases. That is explained to the Quran and Hadith, not me making my own interpretation. When we talk about insan, human, the Prophet explained that, that what is meant by water here is sperm. Right? And, and so, so now he's saying that I'm using it differently. What I'm trying to educate this man is that the seed was already made. We're not using it selectively. Right now, for him, he's caught here because I've given him evidences. So that's why he wants to talk to the camera. Go ahead. So, the basic, the basic issue, the basic issue, and this is my fundamental issue with dollar. Man is created from all kinds of things. <laughs> But this one is talking about water and cells. Is this saying man or all living creation? All living creation. Is all and what living is, what creation mean? What does it mean? What does it mean to be created? It doesn't say one word about cells. There's not one word about what this means. What's the word for it cell in Arabic? Say, it What's doesn't the say. Word? And your okay, interpretation. Listen, 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 listen. listen. If the Prophet ﷺ was going to tell the Sahaba that what's meant here is cells, what word would he use? See, this is your, this is your, where you get stuck, right? Because that word didn't exist. They don't know what cells were. So the Quran gives them a hukum, and later, when the generations realize this, we get the understanding. This is what was meant, and that's why the Quran speaks to us even today in a world of science. Yeah. And this is where you are stuck because you see people becoming Muslim from these things, and now you want to desperately dis dispute it, not learn. The people. And that's why you want to make the your people videos. leaving Islam or leaving Islam because of this. Tell me this: Are more people becoming Muslim or leaving? Uh, I don't know. Go, 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 go check the Pew Institute research. Go check it. Are the Pew research. The Pew research says that the main the main source of Muslim uh, of Muslims is birth rates, high birth rates. No, That's me, what it says. Let me explain. That's what it says. There is a chart there about only reversion and conversion. Mm -hmm. The people that are converting out of Islam and converting into Islam. Okay. Islam is growing mm -hmm. under the subsection of the Pew Institute that has only to do with people converting yeah. to Islam. Yeah. Now you were caught here again, but let me I ask you one. You were because no, you let, said. Let me respond. No, 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 no. Wait, 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 wait. You said it was only because of birth rate. No, I said the main source. Okay. Now, if, you, ta if you take birth sources out, okay. you just talk about people converting. Okay. Are more people becoming Muslim or leaving Islam? Oh, probably becoming. 
they're coming. There are more people becoming. So when I said but, but, people are becoming people Muslim, are no. there are. You're talking millions. Now, now let me ask you this then. Are more people becoming, converting to Christianity according to the same research or leaving Christianity? I don't know. You don't know? No, you, you, you skipped over that part in the research? <laughs> when you were reading the, when you were reading the report, you skipped over Christianity? I didn't read the report. So how do, you, how do you know what it says if you didn't read it? That's a popular... That's a popular but you didn't even video. read the report? I quoted that from... Without even reading the report. I quoted that to show that the main... Wow. Oh my goodness. So you're quoting a report you didn't even read. I quoted a report to show that the main source of growth is birth rates. So no, no. That's what I quoted. Hold on. Now, do you see this? What he did... The Dawah did dodge. Let me, no, no dodging. This, this is, is clarification. This is clarification. What he did, he didn't read the report. He just tried to get the part that would try to seem like people aren't becoming Muslim and use that I as didn't propaganda. Say that. Of course, people right? are becoming Muslim. So now, people are becoming that, Christians. If you that had happens, report, people convert. Are more, when you go home today, when we you go home care. today, when you go home people today, people are becoming check communists. It. What in the check world it. has to do with uh, Not many people are becoming communists nowadays. Uh, more people leaving. More, lots of anyway, hey, lots of people are becoming atheists. It's growing okay, rapidly. Are, it must be are. true. They must have good arguments. Now, let me just give the problem here. All right. So, we look at why people would convert based on this. They get their track and it says, hey, the Quran says all living things were created from water. Yes. What does that mean? The Quran doesn't say what it means. The Quran doesn't does. say what it means. The Quran, doesn't, the Quran doesn't say what it means. So we have to go to Sheikh and yes. he says that what it really means is that there's this primordial whatever and it ultimately becomes the universe. And what we find is a bunch of things that completely contradict a modern scientific view. Doesn't mean they're wrong. Yes, we could always discover later that everything comes from water. Why not? And is it, is a, it a theory amongst what other is a, What is a view? You don't think it's a view? You don't think it's a view? You don't think the scientists have a view right now? You are presenting so, it that all scientists have one view. I didn't. I said it. That's wrong. When you say the scientific view, everything you comes from water. One. If you say the scientific water. view, listen, listen, he knows it. When you say the scientific view, when you use a definitive the, then that means it is the only. If you say a scientific view, you would have been correct, right? But he okay. didn't, because it's the play on the words. The main scientific view, since How I'm not aware, since I'm not aware of anyone, where did you, where did you the Big Bang the and so on is the main scientific view. How All right, keep in mind, no, this no, is no, the guy on, defending science here, supposedly, I do right? Defend science. Okay, yes. so. Science is only so study. notice, ladies and gentlemen, that, right? we've got we've got the miraculous claim. Every living thing comes from water. What does it mean? It means that at the beginning was water, and God used water to make everything else. Yes. Notice if that's what it really means. And by the way, and then we leave out all the different meanings of man was created from this, man was created from that, man was created it. from this, man was created from that. Explained it. Man was created from clay, man was created from dust, and so what me. happens is people have no idea what the actual you know. claim is here. If you actually get the background knowledge, what person is going to say, the Quran says everything came from water, and what it really means is that water was the original substance, and that's been confirmed by science. Oh, is wait it a is? minute, no, it yes, has. that's it been confirmed by of science. Of course it has. Science has confirmed that yes. the primordial element yes. behind me, everything is water. Let me tell you, you hear this? Let me you hear this? Let me, this let me, is your dawah? I will say it again. My dawah was clear. It didn't start today, and it won't end tomorrow. Understand this. Science has confirmed that the building block of all living things that we can test is our cells, and those living things are made, the living cells are made majority of water. That's something science has confirmed. Science cannot go back in time and look at the beginning of universe and test that. So there can be no scientifically challenged fact, no peer-reviewed journal entry on that, because that is something we cannot test. What we can test has proven this ayah to be correct, and now David Wood is upset about it, so he wants to make a video for you and not engage me. I wish he engaged me, but I'm he doesn't want you. No, you're not. You're, you're talking towards the camera. David, they don't see my David, face, man. David, be honest. What? You came to make a video. So of course I came to make you a video. You came to make videos. No, no, I don't. You came I to make videos. I don't. Then you're going to make videos. Let me tell you. Let me tell you. You don't put these videos online? Let me tell you. You don't put these videos online? Let me, let me, let me, let me answer. Let me answer. Okay. I come here to give down. Okay. I came to give down before there was no camera. When people walk up, we ask them, hey, if you don't want to be recorded, we turn it off. I don't come here to make videos, to make money for people to send me Patreon payment. I come to give dawah. We give dawah on other days with no camera. The reason we record is because we got requests from people mm -hmm. saying, hey, you have very beneficial things you say. So it's okay making videos. Let me, let me finish. It's okay let making videos, right? Let me finish. 
إنما الأعمال بالنيات. You know what that means? Come on, just. It's the first hadith in Bukhari. You have Bukhari. Yeah. Right? The first hadith. Every deed is based on intention. Okay. My intention here is to call people to the truth. You came here to make a video. That is your intention. That's what you will get. If you came to look for both. guidance, if you came, look, you already admitted you came here to make a video. You Don't told to me if I have look, objections to look, come to a scholar. I something. have objections. Let me ask you something, Dave. Dave, just a quick question. Did you come here to learn the truth or did you come here to make a video? I came here to examine this argument. Tell the truth. I came here to examine this argument. So to make I think a video? This, I think this to make is a, a video or to you learn? You can do both. I, why can't I do so it on video? If, 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 I, if I convince you, be honest. Yeah. Yeah. Don't, don't play. Because okay. whatever God you believe in, if you okay. believe in a God, yeah, yeah, yeah. right? Yeah. We'll judge your honesty, okay. right? Did you come with the intention that if Sheikh Osman clarifies this, I'm going to accept it? Or did you come with the argument that I'm going to try to... If you clarify this, I would accept it. I would accept it. Let me say that again. Okay. When you were coming here, was your intent... A dawah dawah. It's not a dawah dawah. It's clear. I've answered all your thoughts repeatedly, right? Was it that if Sheikh Osman clarifies this, I will accept and become a Muslim? Or was it, was it that how can I prove this da'wah to be wrong and make a video? What was your main intent to come here? If you show me that Islam is I true, asked you a question. My main intent was to go through this. And to prove it wrong. Was to go through this track. Yeah. You didn't to want to say know. no, I want to say. You see, he didn't come to learn. He didn't come to ask questions. He came to make this video. This guy argues against Christianity all the time. What did he start? If ha ha, you, listen, look at this verse in Exodus. You, ha ha, I got listen, you. What's listen, your intent I've there? Said this your intent is to cause No, it's not. My intent, when I went to study the Bible, and this is something I think you should have known, I didn't go to debate. I didn't go to make videos. I went as a teenager to know the truth. And when I sat with the Bible, I didn't do it from a Muslim perspective. You know my story or you don't? No. Then go watch it. Okay. When I went to this Bible that was given to me, I didn't have any intent to debate. Okay? But when I found this not to be the truth, then I went to other religions, not just Islam directly. Which again, apparently you didn't know. When I found Islam to be the truth, I argued to know the truth. I didn't argue to make videos and get money. And when I found it, I accepted it. And if you came with that intention, to know the truth, today you would have been a Muslim. But you came, but you came with an intent. Don't say that, oh, if you prove me wrong, then I would have. But your intention was to make a video. You did the video, that's all you will get out of it. Look at this, look at this. He tells me, don't embarrass yourself. Yes. If you think you've got a point or you think something is wrong, ask a scholar. Yes. I come ask a scholar okay. because I look at now, this and I say, this does not sound right. When I offer this does him not sound right. To turn and off then, the cameras, and send then, me an email, come see I me that to ask a scholar. I'll do that too. No, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. When I, when I offered him last time even, right? That look, if you want to know, just come and ask. He didn't come and ask. He brought a camera, he made sure the shot is good, and he started to speak to the why camera when why, he got caught. Why because he I? didn't come to know the answer, he came to make videos. Why wouldn't so make your video. I am making the video. Where am I making a video? So, ladies and gentlemen, here's my main objection to Dawah, and this really would, would be the case for all of these. If this is the only information you're given, and that would be the case with someone who's handed this track. They look and they say, wow, origin of life. Oh, we created of every living thing from water. Oh, there's lots of water, main component in cells. This is amazing. They don't tell you about any of the other issues or what it actually means or how there's this primordial water of the, the, the fundamental building block that became, that Allah used to make the universe. They don't tell you about man being created from dust they don't tell you that there are all these different things that we're created from and that they're putting their interpretation in this. They don't tell you that there are Muslims who are convinced that they simply referred to the water that living things reproduce by. They tell you nothing of that. They give you limited information and tell you to base your decision on that. And I don't know what to do with that methodology. There's no, there's no hey, Here's, here are all the facts, now you go out and make an informed decision. It's never that. It's never go through all of this. It's here, accept what we're saying, and if you start going through and finding out, wait, there's some big problems here, there's some real problems in methodology here, then it's, how dare you? What's your intention? You're, you're just trying to make a video. What's your intention? A bunch of dodges and think, does the truth really need this kind of methodology? This kind of methodology. Limited information so that people don't have an opportunity to make an informed decision. Because, ladies and gentlemen, be honest. If you read, we made from every living, we made every living thing from water, and you found out that what it's really saying is that the original substance that Allah created was water, and that everything yes. else became that, 
Would you say that that has been confirmed by modern science? No, you wouldn't. No one ever would. So they don't tell you that. They tell you this, and this is extremely selective and biased, and that is the heart of Dawa. And pow. See, now he doesn't want my answer. Pow. There's no answer. He doesn't, he, he doesn't want my answer. Pow. It's a summary, it's it's a a summary because he knows. It's a Look, video. you know, you know that when anybody gives a flyer out, they're not going to explain all of the of the masail of the creation of mankind. All the problems. All of, no problems. That's why I said we have lessons. We have bigger books. Whoever wants to know can know. This is a three, basically three pages printed flyer. He wants me to explain all of the differences between the cosmos and development and stages in it. And he knows. He knows that when Christians give out flyers, they don't explain all Christian theology in that either. There are many people who give out flyers. They don't explain all of the development of mankind. They give wording to open up people's minds, to spark interest, and we encourage people to then come and ask, not come just to make videos and, and not learn what's authentic from we. So this is da'wah. This is what everybody does. We do it in the honest, proper way of saying, look, here are some things that you should know about. And if you want to know more, come back and learn. Come to the mosque. Sit down with the honest intent to know the truth. But if somebody doesn't want to know the truth, they just want to make bam videos, then this is what they're going to do. They're going to speak to the camera. But if you want to know the truth, Dave, I'm making this offer again. I won't record, they won't record, come talk to me, I'll sit with you with books and I'll explain to you what a chain is and I'll explain to you why we take water. No Muslim says that the universe was created by male and female sperm. No Muslim. This is your addition. No, no, I didn't say that. Yeah, yeah, no, I you, said you, living you, things. Li okay, living so now, things. It is perfect. Listen, no, 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 listen, no, 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 because that's a misrepresentation. You just misrepresented You just misrepresented me. You just misrepresented me. I did not say that. I did not say that. What I said was, if man is created from water, is referring to the, the male and female fluids. Because there's a hadith yeah, yeah, on that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If that's the case, yes. then over here, where yes. it says every living thing yes. comes from water. Because there's a hadith is, on this. Yeah, but every... That but, explains the different usage of the word ma. There's hadith yeah, on it. That's, that's what I'm trying fine. to explain to you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, 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 that's no, no, not no, that's fine. fine. No, 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 but I didn't say, I didn't say no all of creation. No Muslim say living things. all living things came from male and female sperm. No Muslim say. You made that up. That's David No Muslim. one. No one in the commentary should say no that. No Muslim in history said that. Listen to me. Okay. Listen. I haven't talked to every Muslim in history. You just made a claim about every Muslim in history. Listen. listen. I mean, there's one. Can I finish? Can I finish? Yeah. We're not counting the Rafa here. No Muslim that I've ever come across, and that's why I'm going to make this claim blanket, right? Has made a claim that all living things came from male and female sperm. This is your claim. What Muslims have done is when they saw those same word used, they looked at the actual hadith of the Prophet and explained the verse. And that's why I was telling you the above of tafsir. But you didn't want to learn, you just wanted to make your videos. So, no Muslim has made that claim that you are claiming. Muslims have understood the ayat, the verses, and their language in context with what the Prophet ﷺ explained to them 14 and a half centuries ago. And just because you didn't take the time to research that, googling whatever Ahlul Bayt site, doesn't mean that that is a credible source. So when you want to learn, you don't want to make videos, come and talk to me and we will, we will talk. If you don't want to learn, make your videos, get your dollars, be happy. Have a good day. You uh, you told me I could come out here. Can I come out here? Sure. Can but I come out here for discussion? Anytime. But again, the, if the intent is to learn, then you probably want to know about the narration, I want to learn. what's in the book, instead of coming no, in and no, no, saying no, no, something no. on a video look, that look, turns look. out not to be true. See, I'm, I'm, here's where I'm confused, right? So, years of, let's say, philosophy graduate school. People come, they present their arguments. That's all they do. They present arguments. That's all philosophers do, by the way. One person presents an argument, other people criticize it, and then they see what's left standing after after criticisms have been raised. Descartes, when he put out his meditations, he sent it out and told people to criticize it, and he included that at the end. He included that at the end, so people would get be able to make an informed decision. Here's my here's my claims, and here's a bunch of people who criticize me, right? So. You all I'm, yeah, yeah, yeah. All, I, all, I, all I'm saying is, if you're handing out dawah materials, and I take, I take your dawah materials, I take your dawah materials. Yes. You told me if I have a problem, objection, or whatever, come to a scholar. Please. So I see origin of life. I look at that and I say, okay, I see a couple of potential issues. I come out. We record a With video. Your camera. You give your to make a video. Yes. Why not? Why wouldn't we want to? Right? Because that's a, that's a good format. Can I for, No, no. That's my. 
I don't know what your intention is. Your intention is to give doubt. Yeah, yours to give doubt, right? To make and, we see, and we see how people, we see how you give doubt. Give them a very limited amount of information. Nope. Right? Nope. Yeah, yeah, you just need to do this right here. No, no, no. no. My, my, what I want to do. I'll let you speak. I want to put people in a position to make an informed decision. So I want them to hear my criticisms of the claim and your claims and your defense of it. So I walk away and I say, whatever people think, at least they've heard both sides of the story. That's my goal when I come here. Let me hear both sides of the story. Let me, let me rephrase myself. Okay. I was making a friendly offer, which you didn't you misunderstand. That's fine too, hold on, hold on, but that's a different hold on, purpose. Hold on, hold on. See, I let you speak. Let me speak. I was making a friendly offer to help you, okay? which was that if you don't know, instead of worrying about the video, first learn yourself. First find out, is there a book called The Seed of Abbas by Ibn Abbas? What is authentic? What is weak? To help you, so you don't have to go through this learning on camera. I was trying to help you. I would, for Dawa, I would prefer you just come like the way you're coming. Because then the world sees what you don't know. But I was trying to be nice. If you don't want that offer, great. Come back anytime you want with any questions you have. No need to get us, get us a head start. And we'll record it. No problem. I appreciate you guys coming out. You have grown the Dawa more than you can imagine. Your coming out here has given us, I don't know, 30, 40,000 more subscribers. I hope you get a Hold million. Right. This is my favorite. Everybody, subscribe. He said get a million. Subscribe. Right? It's my your favorite, favorite kind of Dawah. I like it. Even, even though you guys don't realize it, I, I, I love for you to come. Right? And I hope you and Hasumu and the princess and what's the... Prostate, uh, you see what the insult? It's not an insult. How's that an insult? How's that an insult? How's that an insult? Call him princess. Hustle. Yeah, because he won't show his face. Let him show his face and we'll find out. And I'll say it to his face. I'm not saying it just behind his back like you guys. I'm saying it to people's face. When I call you hammer time, I did it to your face and behind. Why do you guys call me all these names but not to my face? I call you anyway. Not you, but Sam is called Pippin, all those kinds of names. You think I, you think I, anyway. Listen, I'm saying, Prince, Prostate, whatever you are, come out like this and have these conversations. I appreciate him more than that whatever CP because at least Dave has enough dignity to come out and have a conversation. I was offering him a level more saying, hey, I'll help you understand the things and then when you understand authentic from we, we can still make the video for you to make your point. But it would make you look better because you wouldn't be sitting here that it's a yeah. tafsir ibn Abbas and not know that he never wrote a tafsir. Right? So I'm helping you. No, I know that. I know you that don't that's want the help? I knew that no problem. Like but I kind of like it when you guys say, oh no, I, I'm throwing that source out. Because me, the, more you, the more me, you do that, yeah, the more me, you do that, the more that, right? deceivers there are yeah. in the line. Let me explain. Of, let me explain this, right? Yeah. Now, when you talk about a deceiver, uh, we're not saying that Ibn Abbas deceived anything. That this is the I agree, I agree. Good. Someone in now, the line did. Now, what happens is there are authentic chains, there are weak chains, there are chains where words are flipped, and that's a beautiful thing about the, the sciences of hadith. We check all that, right? And then whether we like it or not, we accept it. When I said the Quran will intercede on the Day of Judgment, I stick to that. But what is meant by that is the, is the action. Imam Ahmad explained it in the time of the Salaf. Like, it's not something new, right? Your problem is you came out and said Hadith and Tirmidhi. If you had come earlier, I could have shown you and then you wouldn't have made that mistake. I was helping you. I you said you yeah, said yeah, yeah. Hadith is Hassan without understanding. Because the, the book said it. If the book's misleading, the book's misleading. Let me tell you, the Hadith being Hassan, if you had looked at the narration, is due to a supporting narration that does not mention Rajin al-Shahid. But if you had, look, I'm saying, if you had asked me, I would have shown you the actual book. Why wouldn't I just then, want to record it then? Because that made you look like a fool. I because you forgot. Oh, then, then fool away. Bro. Look, 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 look. I, I appreciate just, you coming just, out. Like, just to be clear. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Just, just to be clear. Not like that just, just to be clear, though, there are, there are, there are people who. In every conversation, one guy has to crush the other, or it's it's, it's totally And here it's me crushing you, I guess. <laughs> yeah, with the, uh, the amazing water, <laughs> primordial water. Um, me, I don't care. Right? Like, I'm, I'm glad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, I could use a punching bag. I'll, 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 in other words, it's much easier to just say, hey, what's up with this? What's up with this? What's up with this? Cool. And then people get both sides of the story. Cool. And yeah, maybe if I, I did a, maybe if I did a ton of research, then I would be, you know, much sharper. And stuff yes. Like that. But I don't care. I was going to help you with that. I want you to be sharp, bro. Water. Feel your brain, bro. Water. Come on. When you're going to come to me, I want you to come with some stuff. Not come here, not go. Okay. Go so to you book. want me to come with some stuff? Yeah. Okay, we got through one point, man. It would take me ten trips to get through one trap. You keep coming, bro. When, when it's, could it's we actually, when could we actually sit down and just go through the entire thing?
Again, Look, we me, went, I, I, I thought we would, I, I, lit, I literally thought we would spend five minutes on that first call. Let me respond. Good. The issue is, you want to spend five minutes because you don't want to actually learn it. You just want to make a shot, make a video, and move on, right? But hold on, hold on. Let me finish. When you want to learn something, it takes time. If you want to really know both sides, it takes time. I can't give you a time limit because I don't know what kind of a foolish argument you would make and how kind of a response I will give. So how can I say how long it'll take? What I'm saying is, I have a job. I have a family. I teach gurus. I teach every Saturday. I teach the life of the Prophet Every Wednesday, I teach fiqh. That takes research. In that time, I don't take any money for any of that. I assume you were wrong. I don't get paid by the mosque. I don't get paid by OMF. I don't get paid for teaching. Why are you obsessed all... with getting paid? Let, let me explain it. Let me explain why. Let me explain it. Because that means that I have to go to a 9 to 5. So if you're like, hey, give me eight hours of your day to sit through this, that makes sense. I cannot because I have a job. Okay. Now you understand why. So in that, I have given two to five every Sunday for that. You. Anybody else wants to come out, Hostate, whatever his name is, those guys, if they want to come out, this is my time, come on down. Right? You're more than welcome. If you want to know about a particular narration and you want me to look at the authenticity, you. I was offering you, because I think it should probably be offered because now you're like, I want to do it on camera. Okay. I was going to go above and beyond just because you have the decency to come out and stand here. I wouldn't offer this to others. My time, you can ask my students. It's very difficult to get time for me, right? But I was making that special offer. You don't want it? Great. I'll use that time for no, something I will, better. I will take you on that for special. If, no. it, if it's an argument, if it's, here's my Even evidence. if it's not. Yeah, yeah. Even no, 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 I'm telling you. Know. You want to know Hadith or not? I'll help you, bro. Yeah, yeah. But, no, I'm saying on that kind of stuff. If it's an argument, then I basically want to see what the argument is. And then point out any criticisms I might have and you respond to it and, and answer it. That's what I'm interested in because again, if you need to come back 10 times, 20 times, 100 times, come on back. All right. I'll be back. Thanks, bro. This is what we're Keep that going. David, what's up? Have a good day. Thank you. You have to read the value. Enjoy the wife. Enjoy the wife. Interesting looking dude. Thank you. Why do you say that? <laughs> Why do you say that? He's full looking dude. He reminds me of someone I knew, but I can't remember who. You're not going to laugh. I don't know, right? Matt, you can read. You can read. You can read. You can read. So this is the house. No, you want to ask me a PhD. Double time. Hope you enjoy uh, San Diego. Oh yeah. I should move out here. Down. Be out here oh, love it. Yo, yo, yo. So, so that's uh, right. I don't know. All right, you guys later. Thank you. It's interesting stuff. How do you feel about that? What? How do you feel about all that? Oh, it's 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 mainly a time concern, right? Because if it's here's the argument. I could state in two minutes what my objections are to it, right? So my objections to um, everything is created from, I mean, all living things are created from water being a, you know, a miraculous scientific prediction of water in human cells. You know, I could go down the list of my objections to it, um, that if that's what you mean to be created from, then man is going to be created from all these different things. Um, so there, there's that problem, and then, of course, once we really got into the view, the view is that the water is the first thing created, and everything somehow comes from that. And it's not even, it's not necessarily even H2O, according to him. But if it's not necessarily H2O that it's talking about, then it's, what's that got to do with the water in our cells? He would say that the water in our cells ultimately goes back to that water, but so does everything else in all of creation. So it wouldn't matter what you actually found in our cells, it would be confirmation of this. And there's just, I've never heard a scientist say anything like this. And so the, the idea is I could state that in two minutes. And he could state his responses in a couple of minutes. But for some, for some reason, this will take hours. And I'm not sure whether it's intentional 
or not because, you know, I thought I'd go out here and get through 10 points. I thought I'd get out here and get through 10 points. We get out here and get, we get through one point. We get through one point, which means I would need to come out 10 times on average to get through the points in this one Dawa trek. Um, but the point remains, it's, you've got water. You've got water in cells. Muslim apologists claim that there's miraculous confirmation by modern science and that there's lots of cells in water. When all, the Quran doesn't say there's lots of water in human beings or that there's lots of water in cells. It just says we're created from that. If you interpret that as, if you interpret that as, well, there's a lot of it in your cells. Again, what do you do with man is created from clay, man is created from dust, man is created from all these different things. And so the fundamental problem remains, the Quran will say all kinds of things. Muslims never make predictions about what they're going to find in the world based on those. It's only after science discovers something, then they go through, they say, oh, here are the 20 verses that talk about this. Let me find the one that's confirmed, even though what we really mean by this completely contradicts modern science. Right? So, I mean, you, you saw, and here's, here's the takeaway. His view of how we got here, which involves everything coming from water, the universe starts off with water and then somehow becomes everything. That is not any sort of modern scientific view. And so if that's what the Quran is really saying, how in the name of common sense do you claim miraculous confirmation? I do not know. But I'm glad he's out here. I'm glad he's out here. And I think, uh, I think it's good that he actually sets up and allows people to come up and question him.